Previously on the Built within a large oil tank, Suruptu is one of the biggest settlements in Penumbra. Cities' districts protrude from the vault walls, growing downwards at the beat of its oil processing platform. This is the Nexus, one of the main centers of operations for Enki's Covenant in Penumbra. Its frame overlooks the upper levels of the city, its shadow always standing as an unnerving reminder to all vagabonds that there is no place in which they will ever feel totally safe, no place in which the Nexi Eye isn't ever watching. Behind and below the Nexus headquarters, at the end of the Golden Tunnel, a series of Enki Nexus laboratories reside. Here, the Enki develop industrial technology and prototypes. Today, you, the viewer, and I will be sliding back in time. 20 lake years for you and I, and 80 cycles for the people of Surup too. Uh, <clears throat> so, uh, where the hell are we? I, uh, I really don't know. I, seems, um, seems, uh, seems pretty bad. Yeah, this is not good. This is absolutely not good. This is not right. Yeah. This is not. How did you get here? I don't even I don't remember how I got I here. I think I know. I have no idea. I just, I woke up. I was dragged out of some ocean and uh, an ocean wow water yeah some sort of water hey. I, I i couldn't even i, I just opened my Drag? eyes and dragged dragged by some guy and and and, and they called me wow. they, they called me 52 and and and, and said uh, j just follow me and i've been following ever since and same happened to you yeah absolutely i was pulled out of water by a guy crazy guy. um yeah and now i'm here did, did he wear glasses wild uh no oh okay mine wore glasses have you seen anyone since we've been in here no i just in a while followed him i don't i don't really know uh what i'm supposed to do uh here but uh maybe someone will excuse me Wait, shh, 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 maybe we shouldn't. I mean, people that locked us up probably aren't the best to get the attention of, right? Yeah, but at least maybe we could ask some questions and and have a conversation. And well, it's like, how did you? So, so someone in glasses brought you here? Yeah. yeah. Did he I, talk I, to you? I mean, not much. He said I, I wouldn't really understand, and and just uh, no questions now. And I, I I just I was scared, you know. I woke. I don't. I don't. I don't I don't even know who I really am. So you don't remember anything? Weird. I don't either, actually, so. You don't remember? Uh, I mean, I remember you. How, how, did, how, how did you get here? Did you get walked like I did? And we just walked yeah. here and? Yeah, yep, walked here, mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, what's what's your name? Uh, my name. Oh, uh, Susan. Susan. Yeah. Susan. It was given to me by the dude at the water, though. So. Okay. Well. Nice I don't remember meet. anything, though. Weird. Yeah, me neither. I'm. 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 I'm 52. That's a weird one. It feels weird to say. Yeah. Um doesn't feel maybe they're here to give you like a real name because you don't remember anything right maybe it's uh, your family and i got here by accident it's possible i could see it happening do you recognize anyone here at all 
no, I, I don't, I don't recognize you. And I don't recognize any of the people who I've seen so far. So, no. Mm, I'm sure it can't be that bad. This feels bad. I don't, excuse me. I need Very answers, well. I'm sorry. I need, I need some sort of, excuse me. Oh my Lord. Okay. Well, let's, maybe we could get out. Have you tried the door? Where is the door? Open. Is there a door? Is there any kind of, any kind of, hold on. Maybe there's not a door. I'm gonna look um, for some sort of exit of some kind. Is there something I can do? You're muted. You're muted. Oh, for fuck's sake. Um, you do find a line in the door uh, of this metal box that you are in. Um, it looks like it will open, but there's no way for you to do it from this side. How big is the box we're in? Uh, it's a ro- It's the size of a room. You know, it's not a tiny box, but... And can we see through it? No, it's just uh, everything that surrounds you is, is metal. Oh man, I, there I is, have. There is lighting that is coming from bu- un- underneath the plates on the ceiling, but you can't move anything. <sighs> Excuse me! Oh my God. I'm t- I just can't breathe very well right here. Excuse Hello? me! Hello? Here. There's lighting. Why doesn't this work? I'm trying to. <sighs> I don't know, man. Maybe they're not close by. They might have forgot. So your name is 52. Yeah, my name's That's, 52. I'm gonna get that. Where are you that. from? I don't know. You don't know where you're from? No, where are you from? Uh, I don't know. I, you know, I moved around a lot. Not really from anywhere in particular. Where was the last place you were from? I mean, the water, right? I mean, maybe the same water as you. What if we knew each other? <gasps> what if we were knocked out? These people might help us. I'm betting. So we, were, we were born, made in the, in the water? No, but maybe, I mean, we came out, you said ocean. We came out of an ocean. So Seemed like, like maybe, we, maybe a it was a shipwreck. Were you on a ship? Do you remember being on a ship? No, no, I don't, I don't know. I, I never was on, I don't think I was on a ship. Maybe. Were you on a ship? No, I don't remember anything before getting in here, unfortunately. Except you. You're kind okay, of my I'll, only hope at this point. We have to get out of here. I don't, I can't push this. I mean, but where like... would we go? We don't even know where we are. The door slides no. open. Oh. A man stands there, uh, his eyes red, uh, his under eyes purple. Doesn't get much sleep. Um, he's wearing mostly black, um, very strange clothing, in fact. He's a very stern look on his face. Hello. Number 52, is it? Oh, that's him. That's me, yeah. Very well. What? what? Come with me. Where, where, where am I? Don't worry. All will be revealed. Right this way. Okay, oh, okay, Are, is, is she coming too? No, it's not her time yet. Okay, uh, nice, nice meeting you, Susan. Hi, 52. Tell me if you get your memories back. If you remember me, that would be the best. Okay, yeah. I'll let you know. It was nice to meet you. Nice meeting you. The man guides 52 out of the door, and the door closes shut, leaving who we know as Susan behind. So... I imagine you're 
confused, and frightened, scared. I assure you, is absolutely normal. No need so, to panic. No need to worry. Okay, so you, you, you're you're telling me that you've gone through this as well. You you once came out of an ocean, didn't remember everything, and had to go through, uh, be stuck in a metal box, and and, and you've done this. About it, but yes. Yes, I have. Okay. Good. Okay. All right. Well. How are you feeling? How am I feeling? Physically. Are you in pain? <laughs> no. I. Uh, I'm just <laughs> scared out of my mind. <laughs> are you nauseous? Headache? Um. No. I. I. I, I don't think so. Good. Good. Chest pains. Water in no, the air. Oh, I'm having a bit of a panic, a, like a I panic said, button. But besides that, I think I'm okay. Do you remember anything? I remember waking up in water, uh, in the ocean type thing. And uh, I got pulled out and uh, a man said, follow me. And he, he he called me fifty two. That's it. And this whole time I'm scratching notes. <clears throat> um. How long ago did he pull you out? I don't. I, I don't. I don't know. Interesting. What's interesting about that? Some people remember, some people don't. Where, 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 where are we? Where's this? Where, where am I? For now, suffice it to say, you're safe. You're in the middle regions, and you should count yourself lucky. It's a lot better than other places that I've heard of. Okay. We have most of the amenities that you've come accustomed to in the lake. I, I don't. I don't. I don't know anything. I really don't. I. I I'm just. I, I just feel like I'm here, and. Uh, I'd really appreciate it if maybe you could fill in some of the blanks for me on what what what's what's going on. Would that I could. But when a vagabond, that is what you are, just the name we have given. Vagabond? A vagabond? Vagabond. It's the name they give to people like you and me. People who have emerged from the lake. There are so many questions that we still have. And we need people like you to help us answer those questions. But sir, I, 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 I really don't. <laughs> I don't know anything. I, 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 I don't even know. I'm, I'm just 52 and I met someone named Susan and a man who called me 52 and I woke up in water. That's all I know. That's it. That's all I have. I don't have any other answers for you. Have you had your crotch yet? Crotch? Have you smoked anything recently or eaten, consumed? I don't, I, I don't think I, I don't, I don't think I smoke. No, no, I have not. Uh, I haven't had anything. I just. This is frustrating. Someone was supposed to brief you on this before you were handed over to my care. He reaches out with a needle <clears throat> and injects 52 with something. No! <laughs> Don't worry, just breathe, 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 breathe. I, I, I... Whoa. 
Holy shit. Wow. Okay. What's that? What is that? Is that crotch? Yes, in some form or another. Uh, it's to help you acclimate. A acclimate? Get used to this new world that you find yourself in. The environs are harsh and our bodies are not well suited to withstand the rigors of it. But that um, helps. It makes you feel not as heavy. Breathing's not as difficult. Yeah, I feel that. He guides 52 to a medical table and, and pats it for him to sit up Please, on the table. Are Just you, a preliminary uh... exam, I, I assure you. No more needles without your prior knowledge. You, uh, you like a, like a, like a doctor or something? A scientist. But yes, I mean, similar. A scientist, okay, so, uh, have you, have you seen other people like me who don't remember anything? I was one. Uh, yeah, you are saying that, okay. So, so this is pr a pretty common around here then. This is not something it's out of the- common oh but it's not unheard of okay it happens and it's the reasons the origins all of those things are still unknown to us why do we go into the lake how do we come out all of those things are very well that's what you're here to help us with it's at this moment that two other individuals walk in. We see a tall man with a pipe and an apron, uh, and a young boy, probably 16, no more than 17, uh, with welding glasses, dirt on his face. Um, they enter in. Ah, Silas, Cole, good of you to join me. This is number 52. Oi, oi. It, you didn't touch that, did ya? Touch what? That. He point points, oh, no. the, he points device to the machine next to the device bear. next to... No, 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 no. I know how... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you... Can you proprietary can you just, it is to you. Yeah, don't... Don't, uh... Don't touch nothing yet, alright? I need to take a look at it. I'm gonna climb underneath it and just start messing with stuff immediately. Yes, thank you, Cole. This is 52... Yes. He was not briefed. He came to me wet and wild, manic out of the out of the lake. Someone was no one briefed him, no one sat him down and told him that I had to do it myself and I'm not very good at it, I must confess. Well <laughs> Tell me fifty two, what do you remember? Uh, like, like I said, I, I came out of the ocean or that body of water. I was pulled out by a man in glasses. Uh, he called me 52, mm -hmm. walked me for a, a long time. And then all I remember is being in a metal box. That's, that's it, sir. I, I don't know anything else, but I was. Prior to that, nothing at all. Fifty-two. I am it, talking to you. Yeah, no, I know. I'm trying to. I'm trying to think. I'm. I. I, I just. I. N no. Nothing. Nothing. Prior to that. Wait, no. Fuse. Can you eject the cerium flow capacitor? The, the what? You, what? Not you. Uh, no, I know. But what? Okay. Sorry. Yeah, pay fucking... no mind to the business. Yeah. Don't. I ain't talking to you, man. You. Little cretin. Fuse, eject it, quick. Okay, I honestly didn't hear my name, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. Serium, serium right. flow capacitor, mate. I walk over, All right. uh, and I eject what I think he's talking about. Into me? No, I'm, I'm fiddling with his machine. Okay. Do good. it. It's done. 
Because yeah. there ain't nothing called a Syrian flow capacitor. It's so what did you in, eject? Uh, well, something with liquid inside of it. Yeah, that's a radial glue on. Yeah, we need that. Probably should put it back in. Can I just put it back in then? Yeah, hold on, right? This is going to get a bit loud. Okay? Start well, going, is this absolutely necessary right thing now. underneath? Yeah, it's necessary. What, you want to blow his eyes out of his head? Wait, wait, b blow eyes out of my head? I don't want my, my eyes to blow out of my it head. It will be fine, 52. Everything is fine. If you would <laughs> like, you can just go ahead and lay your head back right on the gurney. No, I, I'm okay. I'd actually like to leave. I don't feel comfortable. Yes, yes, Boy, I, where's I, Violet, though? I'm sorry. Chung Ting, innit? <laughs> Okay. Right. I'm gonna go. Uh, thank you guys. I, I, so, I would I would implore you to lie down. Fifty two. I'm gonna I'm gonna explore be... myself to get up and leave because I don't want my eyes popping out of my head or anything. I don't know yeah, anything. I have no busy. answer. What? Stand up from out of the from underneath the thing and I'm looking at him over. Mate, what's them gums though? What you put him in? Cole, would you do me a favor? Would you take fifty two for a small walk and maybe help him relax? What? Where am I going to take him? Up and down the corridor. I don't know. Just help him a bit while we figure out what we will do next. All right. Yeah. Come on. Come with me. You. Let's calm you down. Yeah. Okay. But you're not going to take me to some room and just kill me or something, right? No, I don't think. All 52. Just relax. Yeah. I'm taking this with me, though. Oh, God. Yeah, I don't trust you, mate, okay? You don't trust me, I don't trust you. Come on. I'm not gonna do it. I don't know any... I don't... I'm... You ain't gonna know anyone at all. Come with me. I'll get you some, uh... I'll get you some, uh... Syrian fluid. What, Syrian fluid? Cole walks 52 out and down the hallway. There is a mon moment of silence between Silas and Fuse before two other individuals enter the room. So like I was saying, they named him a number. Is that normal? Very normal, Violet. Yes, they... Uh, it's a classification, you see. They don't have a name anyway. Might as well they just can't give them even a number. count that high. It doesn't make any sense. Violet, that's ignorant. They didn't uh, lose their mental... <laughs> it's ridiculous. <sighs> Violet. Hey, Silas, Violet. good morning, Fuse. Yeah. Good morning. Did you not understand your job my job ask of hold you. on it's you, the morning you, i just arrived can we not you reckon violet some of us have been my job is to detain morning. and deliver your job I did such as your job includes letting the vagabonds know what is going on calming them and preparing them for what's to come gaining their trust this man that you brought is is it, it panicked and it, I, I i i i am not the one who is supposed to be telling that him what is going on call me i'm now. sorry okay god he was talkative i just kind of let him go with it for a while it was interesting to see him try to escape the box. Let me know that you understand what I'm saying. Details. I'll tell him more, whatever. <laughs> well, Panic physically, he looks good. I think he'll pull through. I don't think... Healthy? I, 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 I feel like we're on the cusp of something great. I believe so as well. The panic is a good news uh, when it comes to uh, the subconscious reacting to uh, prior events that may or may not be veiled by the reality of the lake. So we will be able to, uh, if we can, uh, tap inside the psyche and maybe unlock who he is. Are you thinking of trying a uh, uh, more of a panic response, increasing that then? Going that route this time? Mm, it is something we are able to, we are capable of doing. I'm... If he's already there, it's not exactly a big leap. 
Yes. Where did you take them? I thought they would have been strapped down by now. Strapped? Oh, I'm telling you, he would be, but he was... <sighs> That's beside the point. He's with Cole. Hopefully Cole is talking to him, telling him what's oh, going on. Sent it with Cole, that lunatic. <sighs> I Maybe he can speak his language. But more importantly, exactly. I want to know, are the other subjects secured? What do the you non-human mean? subjects. Of course they always are. Why do you have to worry about that? They were fed this morning. I, I'm, I don't neglect their feeding. It's the first thing I did. Thank you. At least someone, look at Violet, knows how to do their job. Oh, let her be. I'm bored. Are we done? Yet? Work is never done. Uh, I, I mean, my work here is pretty obviously done. Violet. No, it's fine. That's fine. Just Simus looks at Reckon. Pull it back a little, please. Never helps. Okay. Uh, so, what is on the docket for today outside of, um, well, <laughs> the usual uh, panic inducing scanning? Um, are we is anything special today? Or just the standard silence? Well, oh, so I would I like didn't to realize have a... that that was you going to talk by mistake. I didn't either. <laughs> Go on. What? Give me that sorry, I missed that. No, 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 nothing. Continue, please. I would like to take, uh, or g- give you a checkup, Reckon. I want to see how everything is going with you. The shakes have gotten better. Good. It's fantastic. How's the noise? It's calming down a bit, but machinery still gives kicks. A bit of a sensitivity in the psyche. He has night terrors. Mm. They're not even words, more like eat boop in the middle of the night. Not the most pleasant sound. You can somehow Mm. settle that off. (sighs) For what it's worth, I don't really remember them. Scratching notes. I'm scratching notes all the time. I remember, remember them for you. They're loud. Loud. Have we worked on a better distillation project process for the crush? It does help a bit. I do not know. That is something to ask Cole. <sighs> this is a really long walk. I'm just going to say that corridor is not that long. I am quite worried about capabilities of Cole and the distractions of his mind, but... Yes. Well, I'm working on my own process. Um, do you know that Kraj more or less can... Uh, he drank. You don't say. Yes, I've been working on a process for that. Um, I am, <laughs> it's a little more pleasant um, if you don't want... I kind of look a side glance at his pipe. Your lungs to decay. Uh, that can be a way to do it, although it may affect the liver um, as you had warned. I was yes, the... smoking a long wooden pipe, but it's at this point we notice his jaw, his metal jaw. He has some cybernetics. Think so, uh, what are you going to do to 52? You never let me stick around and watch the fun, but uh, this one remembered glasses over here. Yes, he did. Uh, He remembered the trip. Wait, he remembered the trip? Oh yeah, he did. He did. He, maybe you should have more of your shake. Wait. He remembered coming out of the water. He remembered everything. Who remembered? 52, dude in the hall missing with coal. He said he, explicitly said several times he remembered nothing. Sure. Well, he told me he remembered getting pulled out of an ocean by someone with glasses. And all I'm oh, saying he is remembers in... being pulled out. Oh. Yeah, but they don't yeah. remember that part usually. Usually they're all goo goo ga drooly all over the place. And this one was like... Well, yes, you know. that's why... I'm this assuming that's why. why he's the subject. 
I mean, I never asked. Urgency of delivery is always of utmost importance, for we don't have these uh, memories for them to linger. I brought him back as fast as I could, as always, Silas. Yes, yes, well. Maybe he just has an exceptional memory. That could be a good thing. Maybe he'll retain things better. Mm. I don't want him to retain me. Can you, like, well, you didn't use scrub your... scrub in there, maybe? Do you usually scrub first? Yes, that is the standard procedure. I mean, I don't stick around for that part. Normally, I don't care, but since you want to stay, I guess I can ask these pertinent questions. Reckon. Yes, What please. do we have in the hold? Oh. Uh, I know we, no. have, we, had, we had a couple of shock tales last time I looked. Yes. Have anything new? Lord. I know you're bored. Okay, and there she goes. That's wow. fine. Fetch. Fetch them while you're out. Oh, the shock tales. Well... <laughs> you may be surprised to hear this. We recently got in a mermaid. Intact. You did? A mermaid. An entire mermaid. Intact. I used Still Shiv's, alive. I used Shiv's help, but yes. It is alive. How? You know what? That, 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 doesn't, that doesn't matter. I want to see it immediately. Well, it's in the containment cells. Of course, in water. Do and very wish. highly protected. It's Do very hard to, to neutralize it. Mm. As well, maybe perhaps 52's procedure. That could work, but we still need to run a few more tests. It's very unstable. Mm. We've barely ever had these in, in con... I mean, I think, what, this is the third, I yes, think? Yes, And everyone usually just, well, for lack of a better term, explodes, if you recall. I do recall. So we've had some yes, we've had some failures, but we, we just, will have success. I I I I know it. I know it. The last time we were we were so we rushed. Lo- we rushed. Breath a breath we, away. We cannot rush it. I'm I'm going to go inspect the new specimen. That's Let me fine. know if if when when and if 52 is ready. Do not touch the button on the left. Bad idea. It could kill it. It's a failsafe. Noted. <sighs> so at this moment, Cole and 52 return from their walk. Yeah, so basically, right, when I was just 12, I like rewired one. You know what I mean? So I, I made it so that it could only say shit and fuck. <laughs> right? So everyone's going up to this Way Watcher asking it questions and that. And it's just going shit, fuck, shit, oh, fuck, cool. fuck, fuck, shit. Fuck. <laughs> it was well funny Ooh. though. Basically, that's, that's what got me in that's trouble. Crazy. They me up. You know, well, need I remind you that he is in his infancy of waking up as a vagabond? Oh yeah, I gave him a name though. I called him Jam. Jam, yeah, great. You gave it a name. Yeah, wonderful. You know what I mean? Because like he needs to relax. Yeah. So I've Cole. been calling him Jam. Cole. Yeah. Lake words. You're the guy. You're, you're the guy who found me. Ooh. Come on. Lake words. You're better than that. Right, listen. I've got to go and turn the chromium flow off, because I just remembered that I left it on. Uh, yeah, uh, that's a good excuse. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, all right. So you don't have to call him Jam. Like, I just thought maybe it would be, you Thank know, it calm cool. him down. All right. You know I mean? Wait, am I, am I, am I, am I 52 or am I jam? Whatever makes you happier. Yeah, he's the chief. What makes you happy, 52? I don't know, I, I, I started laughing when he said fuck. <laughs> Would you like to be called fuck? I don't know, that'd be kind of fun. Sure, that, that seems like a good nickname, don't you agree, Silas? Fuck, it is. Okay, for now. I'm just... Reckon, by the way. Fuck, it's... Re- reckon, you, you're, you're, you're the one who found me, right? Yes, I am. I'm terribly sorry you had to rush over here. Um, it, I could tell that you were having difficulty breathing. Yeah. Uh, did uh, Fuse help you with that? You seem to be breathing better. Yeah, he, he, he shot me up with something that made me feel uh, able to breathe a little bit better. 
The Kraj. Yes. Yeah. Uh, the Kraj. Kraj. Yes. Kraj. Yes. Kraj. You are feeling better now. I think so. Yeah. The, the, the walk was nice. He told me that uh, uh, about a, a Waywatch bot called fuck and, and shit and stuff like that. So, yeah, I, 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 feel, I feel better. Mm-hmm. Good. And Would I you think mind? at this point, Silas makes his way behind him and as he's like talking, and then he's just going to. And I'm like his engaging on his temples and just slowly guide him to lay down on the gurney. Okay, so this is all protocol, this is all normal. We need yes, to make sure you're normal. healthy and safe. Yeah. Cool. He was telling me about this, okay? This is fine. Yes, this is perfectly normal. You you know what a doctor is? Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, the Silas idea. is our best doctor. No. Okay, uh, but am I, am I hurt or anything? Is there anything wrong with me? We're making um, sure you're fine. Isn't that right, Dr. Silas? Yes. Yes, that is... That is, we will be finding whether or not you are okay after surviving such a uh, traumatic experiment. You almost I drowned. Experience. I didn't experience. Like I almost Silas. drowned. That, that's what happened. So, so what? That's I, was, I, I was on a ship? You must have been, maybe. We're trying I, to figure that out, but we want to make sure you're ship? okay. Hmm? What is a ship? Like a like a barge, but for water. That that Silas. that girl, Elias that girl, asking, Susan. I was Susan was telling me about the ship. Perfectly about what it is. Reckon I am. Apologies. Asking the subject. My apologies. I step back a few feet. You will. Yeah, like, like I, I was I was just saying, uh, Susan had told me about that maybe we were uh, lost at sea together. And on a ship together, so that's why I said the ship. We will. What are What are you twisting? What is, What's What What's going on? Nothing. I am just taking notes. For, oh. I just want to make sure that you are all right, and I do want to make sure that you are happy with the current state of things. Reckon if you could do me a favor. Yes, sir. And start the procedure. I will take these notes. Absolutely. The questions. And I pull down my goggles. Do I need do, do I need to wear some of those goggles? No, these are just for. Uh, it, no, no, you'll be all right. Um, okay. And I quickly, before he can move, hit a button and clasps go around his ankles and wrists. Okay. Well, uh, what's the point of that? Why? Wh- why am I? All right. No, 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 no. Nothing's all right when you're chained. He's- well, yes, it is to restrain you in case we have some sort of, um, uh, well, some sort of... Some sort of what? Energetic. Allergic reaction. Proceeds. Allergic to what? Back in. Thank you. Reckon? Yes. Those specimens yes. are excellent. Very fine work. Thank you. Specimens? Listen, guys, whatever you think I am or did, I didn't do it. I, I'm probably just some normal person. No, and- we know, fuck. You are not, you are fine here with us. It will be fine. You've not done anything wrong. I know, but, but why are you contrary, chaining me up? But on the contrary, is- you are not being held back for your actions, but you are being held down to be, to forge our future. What does that even mean? What do you mean by that? We can learn a great deal from you, fuck. Learn a great, you can learn a great deal from, if you, if you look at yourself every day, you learn a lot about things like, I, I, I didn't do anything you, wrong. You I, know I pro- many things that we do not living inside of the lake. Hey, but I promise I'm not a bad guy. I, I, I don't know You're what you guys think I did. I'm not, you've what? done nothing wrong. You're not a bad guy. You've done nothing wrong. Okay, so We're please get me out of you. these. Chain we things. We will get you out of these. I come over with a syringe. No, Thank no, you. no. You it's slightly. It has a drug in it that's slightly euphoric. It's please, like please. take take like Molly or XC or something, and then just like make it real mellow. And I just no. I jab it into you. No, you said you would tell me. You said you would ask. <laughs> ah. oh. Calm down. Oh man, I, I promise you guys, I, 
And mm-hmm. I didn't, I didn't do anything. I, I promise. I, you know, yes. I don't you know anything. Done anything. I don't know anything. You're yeah. about to do so much. Just relax. Okay, okay, I'll relax. But I just want you to know, I, I promise you, you I. Feeling. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm just not a bad guy. Fifty-two. Yeah. Listen to the sound of my voice. Okay. I want to thank you. You are going to be a pioneer, an explorer, the first human to understand certain things that have stood in the way for years, for cycles upon cycles. If this goes exactly how we think it will, your name will live in history forever. Wow. You should be proud. As 52 drifts off, he hears something. A voice, a woman's voice. 52? 52? And then he passes out. And we switch scenes. We are joining Cole and Violet. Oi, what are you doing in here? Oh, I can't let that dude see me. They're already pissed off. I didn't calm him down. What do you think he's going to think? He sees, like, the casual other prisoner just hanging out with the dudes in the, in the, whatever that room is. What are you guys doing there? I don't know. They're well vexed, mate. I don't know why they get so pissed off with them, though. Like, just pluck another one, you know what I mean? Just swim down and get one. I'm saying there's, like... I mean, I'm never sure to work. <laughs> They've never gotten pissed at me before, but apparently this one being panicky was weird, so... Different yeah, shit going down, who down. knows? Listen, though. Right? Problem is... The... The containment collectors are probably going to overheat. So... I think they're going to fuck him up, you know? Wait. Yeah, whoops. Like... Like, make him, like, arms out of his forehead kind of thing? Like, fuck him know. up? Or like, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Like, I was trying to work it out a little bit, and then Reckon was getting all like, oh, use your leak words, you know what I mean? And then, then I, I made up some shit and left. He really needs to drink more of that shake he's got going on. You know what Why I mean? Why are you dressed like that, though? Am I dressed like what? You got, like arms on you know no like you're looking lush though you know what i mean like we can like uh you know i can work oh, with this absolutely not oh my <laughs> reckon reckon now they're gonna be busy right and then about probably about three minutes it's gonna overheat anyway probably mess up everything and then they're gonna call for me so oh are you like so cleanup we... crew i mean i can be your cleanup crew oh my god We've got three minutes reckon! This has been great. I think I'm gonna go walk that corridor maybe or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. I'll, uh, yeah, I'll follow along, like, you know? Great. Yeah, that sounds like a really cool idea. I'm gonna start, like, speed walking past him down the hall. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm gonna go, like, I don't know, fix the Omni Sander or whatever. Cool. Yeah, it was so awesome having this conversation with you again. Lovely yeah. participating in this venture. Yeah, don't walk in there, though, because I'm scared that it's going to, like, melt his eyes. Yeah, okay. I mean, it might hold out. I don't know. I think I'm probably going to get in trouble again, though. Sure. Yeah, I won't check on the melted eyes. Maybe smoke some more of the shroom there, bro. You're seeming little off I mean you got any I could stop by yours and get some no reckon keeps it all because I'm gonna smoke it I mean you want me to get some we could like go somewhere no I'm pretty sure I have to wait for reckon 
All right, he's and we not can wait usually and wait. in there this long. Is he like part of this one? What? What's so special about this one? No, I called him Gems. I don't know, but everybody seems all uptight about this one. I didn't calm him down. I didn't tell him what's up. Do I ever tell him what's up? No, because I don't know what the hell's going on in that room. Is he special though? Because like, basically I, mean, I didn't do any of my checks. Oh, so you didn't do your job? Maybe that's why the eyes might melt off? I mean, like I did my job, but you know what I mean? Like they sort of go through them like. Go through them? Listen, mate, I was like, pretty hungry, so I was eating. And then they came in and they were like, all right, we're bringing one in. And I was like, oh yeah, don't, <laughs> don't mess with that. And then I checked and I'm like, nah, this is gonna overheat, mate. This is gonna overheat the moment they turn it on. But then I was like, I can't say, you know, I can't be like, ah, this is gonna overheat. Cause then they're gonna be like, Reckon's gonna be like, oh, why didn't you check all your stuff or whatever? Then I'm gonna be like, man's vexed. And he's gonna be like, you've done all this, you're you're the worst. And then You should probably do your job better. Oh yeah, listen, nah, it's all safe, you know what I mean? Like I ain't shook, but basically, if it melts his eyes, like how important is this one? Did I Violet, did I hear you calling for me? Yes. Is, can we go? This is like really long in this place. This usually doesn't, you know, I'm kind of like, ugh, outside. Feels oh, bad in I'm here. Can... Not my favorite. Well, we're actually going to need you back in the cell. Uh, who we're calling the 52, or fuck, I guess, uh, is uh, uh, going to be sent back to the cell. The first uh, round is complete. I have to be in here with him after that? Oh, oh no, absolutely sorry. not. Absolutely not. Reckon you sit in here with post-experiment, creepy boy. No, I'm not he knows who I am. He thinks you're still one of them. Hey, you but can they... still think, though. That's good, isn't it? Good sign. He can still think, right? I mean, yes, he can still yeah, think. Yeah, yeah, he didn't same. remove his ability to think. Like, that's no. not normally what we... I would kind of defeat the purpose. Right. It would be... Could you please, Violet? Yeah, if that's questions... Cool. And then after we can get a coffee with that and lunch, we fucking need to eat. What am I supposed to ask him? How was the drag from the water? No, like, do you remember anything else? Did did it help? Are you feeling better? Uh, oh. Things like that. He should have some new memories now. So All we're right. just seeing what he remembers, be friendly, ask some questions. Friendly. Standard. Friendly. Friendly. You know Got how it. to be friendly. Yeah. Don't fit me. <clears throat> Cole, don't you oh. have? Don't you have what? something to hammer? I mean, I could go take a look at the machine if you want. I mean, I'm sure it's fine. There's definitely no destabilization, right? I heard a little bit of a rattling. All right, I can Who check knows? it. It's probably just the auto sequences. That'd be fine though. It won't melt his eyes. <laughs> oh my God. I, I, don't, I don't want to see melted eyes again, Cole. I swear. Yeah, I know. Neither do I. That's what I'm saying. I checked it like probably like four or five times. You know what I mean? I barely slipped. So yeah, anyway. All right. See you later, Violet. Bye. Oh, I hate that man. Oh my God, I can't, I can't do that again. We can't do this anymore. He has to go, I can't. He keeps talking about exploding eyes. Is that like a joke? We don't explode eyes. Not intentionally, no. Intentionally? Well, that's what I said, not intentionally. We, we don't we But don't do you've blown up eyes? This has happened I once, one time, but I, I, I it's Cole's fucking fault. He slept through his shift. <laughs> and we're just casual about this? I don't think. It was I three mean, cycles ago. Guy... It was three cycles ago. If you say so. It's better, it's better. I've checked his work. It's He's a loony, but he's very good at what he does, at least when he actually focuses. 
Ah, so you'll have to go back to the cell. My apologies. Um, I'm gonna back through the doorway into the cell. Um, I need to. He touches to... me. Don't push him off. We're having He's... a conversation. No, I understand. No, I know, I know. I'm not gonna let that happen again. You know that. Mm-hmm. You know that. I don't want anything to happen to you. Yeah, yeah. I don't usually sit in here with the post subject. I'm not 100% what that's gonna be. I know, I need to talk to Silas about it, but it's over my head. All right, bring him in. All right, I need to go and <sighs> check in. A few sets asked me to, <sighs> I need to get one of the sparklings. So I'll, <clears throat> <sighs> we have to connect him to that. I hate this one of them. That's what we need to do. Whatever. Be safe. I know you will. Um, yeah. Lunch uh, after this. Lunch would be great. I am starving. I heard they got shock tail steaks in. Oof. Oof. Oh, they fattened them up real good this week. Oh my gosh. Sounds yeah. incredible. I've got extra creds for it, so I got lunch this time. Oh. Mm-hmm. That's Good, your reward. I'm Thank. Broke is a joke. I know, I know. You need to stop fucking buying all that shit. I mean, weapons. Hello. This one was like completely conscious when we pulled them out. Rope would have been helpful. Is all I'm saying. I know. I know. I know. Smarter at this normally than I am. All right. Facts. All right. I'll wait. I'm cool. Go get him. I'll shut in the. I'll. I'll have to lock it. Uh, just for appearances, I know. Yeah, yeah. So, all right. I'll uh, see you in a bit. Bye. The door locks. Awesome. Host subject. Cool. Wonder if he has metal jaw like Mr. Sirius does. Could be cool. Maybe he'll talk less. Could have strapped it shut. Been nice. Uh, oh, what the? the door opens and 52 wanders in. Uh, oh, you're back. Oh, my. Did they? Oh, f- fuck. Fuck. Oh, yeah, I just woke up. How oh, are you doing? Oh, my God. They, they, they your they, eyes. Oh, my. Do they look weird? It's a little stingy. Let's rub the sleep out of them. They put something. They put like some sort of. I don't know what they put in my eyes, but they, they sting so bad I can barely see them. What, what do they look like? They're completely bloodshot, and uh, it looks like his iris is changing color a bit. You had yellow eyes, right? Sure. I don't. Yeah, a, it's, they're this, yep, they're the same. They're just, it just looks a little like sleepy. Okay, cause they hurt so bad. <sighs> maybe, maybe rub this, I don't, ooh. What did they uh, do to you in there? Just eyes? They, they, I don't, they, they gave me a, some sort of, some sort of sedative and, and told me I, I was gonna be something. Wait, and I'm gonna grab his face really quick and look at his eyes. What's wrong? They're moving from like a honey brown to uh, a blue. Ew, weird. What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? No, nothing. Your eyes are, your eyes are blue. You just said they were yellow. Yeah, it might have been the light. It's weird lights in here. Wait, do I have blue eyes or yellow eyes? Really blue eyes. Oh, they're completely blue now. Very pretty eyes, yeah. Thank you. Did they, did they put something in your eyes? What happened with you? Are you okay? I, I just woke up, man. I just woke up. I passed out after you left. They might have like gassed me or something in here. What are they gonna gas us? Uh, well, just like sleeping. Like, I don't know, maybe for rest or something. Okay, okay. I, I gotta tell you something. I, uh, I think I remember something. What do you remember? Okay, uh, all I saw 
was uh, me in my in my Mustang. I must have driven a Mustang or something. And I I, I was driving along and the sun was setting and I, I was al- alone in the car, holding the wheel, looking out. And I was, I was smoking some sort of cigarette or something. And uh, I, I was just happy. I had a big smile on my face. And that's it. Wait, 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 wait. Did they like show you a movie in there and like, you know, give you like something to kind of base yourself off? Or is this like, you're remember, are you remembering something? Are you remembering something? I don't know. I had like a, a kind of a dream, I guess, uh, where I, I, I saw myself in, in, a, in, a, in a Mustang and it was red and I was just driving and smoking a cigarette and listening to something. I don't, I don't remember what was on, but it was <laughs> kind of magical. Yeah. And then they put some stuff in my eyes and it starts to burn and it's still kind of burning. And I guess I, I now have blue eyes, but I had yellow, you said? It was a honey color. It might've been the light though, you know, like a reflection on your eyeball. It's fine. Okay. I remember a car. Yeah, Mustang. Mustang. <laughs> Anything else? Uh, y- you can call me fuck. <laughs> I can call you what? Oh, that, that's the name. You can call me fuck. That's my name. Uh, one of the guys gave me. Uh, I had a choice between 52... I think like I forgot the other one and, and fuck and I just th- fuck made everyone like giggle so I like that <laughs> all right I'll call you fuck okay thank you I mean you don't yeah. have you can call yeah. me by my original name too 52 I'll answer to that as well but nah. this is fine okay. so did they like talk to you in there at all yeah Are they're like how many people were there uh, one, two, three. The guy who found me, some crazy uh, guy who had a very scary accent. Um, uh, the guy who pulled us out of the cage, and then there was one other who was the one who walked me around, who took me around and 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 showed me the place and and gave me the name Fuck. Weird. Yeah, but I. I don't, they, they Are said I'm different a, at all. Did they do anything? Just your eyes? I don't know. I, I don't feel different. I, they said I'm going to do, I'm going to be the first. the first. So I don't know. What? I don't know. I did, that's all I remember. And then things went kind of black. So I, I, I still don't really um, understand what's happening, but I feel like things are are getting a little bit better maybe that's good that's good yeah wow what's a cigarette oh well from what i remember uh you you smoke it and it makes you feel more relaxed because i seem very relaxed and the door opens and silas is standing there how are you feeling fuck um my eyes are kind of burning, uh, and and apparently they went from yellow to blue, uh, so I don't know uh, if that's normal. But other than that, I'm okay. I think. And they're blue now. He leans in. Yeah, they're blue. Very well. Is that is that a good good thing? Yes. Please. We have more to do. More, more, more what? More procedures to make sure you are okay and acclimated to your new environment. Okay, I'm I'm just going to say this. I I feel pretty good. Very well. You may feel it, but you don't look it. No, you look terrible. Maybe you should come inside. He moves what do you mean? to the side. I, I don't. Th- Doesn't he look terrible, Violet? I 
Violet. You said your name was Susan. Who's Violet? It gave me a new one too. Kind of like you, but fuck. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, Violet. you do look real sweaty though in your eyes. Do you kind of did that thing. Maybe they can make you feel better faster. Yes, you could adjust. Okay, yeah. Um, I, I'm starting to sweat a little bit actually, you're right. But it is kind of, we are stuck in a box. Um, okay, uh, sure. Uh, sir, like whatever you... Please. Okay. Stylus walks out of the room. Violet has the opportunity to stay out in the hallway or she can sneak in and try to watch. She's going to try to watch. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, first roll, please. Violet, go ahead and roll for me. You don't have to use the three. You can just go ahead and roll from your sheet if you'd like. Okay. So you're going to sneak in undetected. What is this like? Um, she probably, sorry, roll 20 just froze for me. She okay. probably would. So it's one laboratory. Is there one door to it? Um, there are a couple of different yeah, doors. Home. It's a pretty small lab, but yeah, there, there's one door to the right of where you are. And then there is a, another door, which is more like a garbage chute, uh, at the other end of the hall. So there's only one door that you could exit from here. Yeah. Okay. Um, she'd probably try to creak the door open and like peek to see if anybody's nearby, if anybody could see her and then okay, so try to watch Violet's the door. also 15, 16, right? Yeah, the same age as Cole? Small. Okay, yeah. So she's pretty tiny and, and slender and I think we see her peek her head out and Silas is guiding 52 uh, into the into the room and Violet will kind of sneak down and crawl underneath maybe the flooring panel on one of the left sides, left side, so you can actually yeah. see through the grate. Yeah. Okay, so she can see everything uh, through the grate. And Cole, Reckon, and Fuse are here. Fuck's sake. Did you run it twice? Of course I did. Straight away though. Didn't I tell you not to run it twice straight away? What did we not run twice? It's damaged, I think. The neogenic scrubber, it should be all right, but it might overheat if you want to run it again, I mean. Is it going to interfere with what we're planning now? I yes. know. All right. Might do, might not. 52 or oh, fuck, please have a seat. Okay. Okay, are you gonna be st strapping me down again? I promise yes. I won't move. Okay. We will have to it, just to get your own safety. safety. Yeah, you're going to want to fucking strap him down for this one. What is it? Reckon? Oh. Yes, Fuse. Did you bring it? Yes. And I pull out a uh, small carrier uh, with a cat sized creature in it. Uh, right here. One of our friendlier ones, I'd like to keep it that way. Was... Is it clean? Is it injured? No, no, it's perfectly fine. Very healthy. I've made sure of it. Very well. Set it on the table. <laughs> what, what, what's that thing? This, and I gesture to it, this is a sparkling. A, sp a spark? Okay. What is One that? One of the more common denizens of our area. We know a lot about them, more than we do about almost any other creature. Yeah. And do you mind if I quickly just strap him up so I can get some readings as you explain this? I think this would be a perfect time for me to get some readings. Absolutely. Reading. Reckon if you would, please. Yes, okay. I'm walk over. Please lay down. So we're a few, so yeah, I'll... And hit the button again he and clasp the table. Oh. Okay, all right. But what are you planning on doing with it, with, with, with that thing uh, in here? Why is it in here with me? Uh, are you t testing that as well? I in a manner. band Let's across speak. your forehead. Okay, oh, okay. <laughs> uh, so this is, you guys have all been through this. You guys all did this too when you first got here? <laughs> Not all of us, but enough of us. Yes. Okay. 
How do, how, how, how do I join the, the side that doesn't have to go through this? Because I, I, honestly, I feel better. My I, my sweat's going away, and I, I would, I, I'm I'm okay to get up now. I think I I think can this at least be the last? <laughs> okay. Okay. Calm down. Okay. Now, oh. this will all work out better uh-huh. for you, for our little friend here. If you try and remain calm, mm, yeah. you try and... Do you meditate or anything like that? I don't believe so. I don't, I don't know if I meditate. Well, what I want you to do Oh, God, right now. I'm kind of freaking out here. I'm I, know, in- I know, I know. There's nothing to be worried about. Okay. All I want you to do, breathe. <sighs> Deep breath in through the mouth. Mm-hmm. Out through the nose. <sighs> now close your eyes and think. Think of a place that's warm. Picture it. Tell me about it. What's the first place that you think of that's warm? Uh, uh, who? Uh, data. There's no wrong answer. It's uh, like a, it's like a road, and I'm in a Mustang. I look at Silas to like, are you getting? Okay. He nods. I am. This is very uh, good. I'm on, a, I'm on a road of some sort, and I'm driving down with mm-hmm. a cigarette in my mouth, and I'm just. <sighs> Uh, breathe, uh, breathing. I'm just breathing. So you remember certain things. You remember the cigarette, the yeah. driving, mm-hmm. sunshine. Okay. Think yeah. about that. Look to your left. What do you see? See, uh, and I motion for Reckon to bring the the animal over. Yeah, I take it out of the crate. It, it willingly lets me pick it up. It looks like a cat. Um, its face is very small, and it has a fluffy tail, except it's not fur. It's um, something different, soft skin. And at the end of its tail, it has two prongs. It looks like it would attach to feed and get electricity. Reckon brings it over. It is very friendly. I'm stroking I, its head. And I, I grab, uh, it looks like just a mess of like metal bars. But once I spread it out, it it kind of looks like an, like an exoskeleton. And that's kind of what it is. I put it over top of the cat or over top of the sparkling. Yeah. And attach each like joint to this thing. And it lets you do that just fine. What did you as see? As I'm talking to it. What do you uh, see? Some, I see uh, some trees, um, maybe like, a, like dead. they're kind of dead, but it's kind of beautiful at the same time. Um, uh, sand. A bit of sand, kind of like I'm just out in the middle of nowhere. I want you to, I want you to stop the, stop driving, not suddenly. Just stop driving slowly. You want me to pull over? Yes, pull over. Okay, I'm pulling over. Now, I want you to exit the vehicle, and I want you to take off your shoes. Okay. I want you to walk out to those trees. I want you to feel the grass. And I'm putting, I'm lowering like a a skull cap kind of looking thing over the sparkling. Um, And I I motioned to Silas, like, he's ready. Go ahead, put put your things on on 52. Well, initiating. Do you feel the grass? Yeah. Do you smell the nature? The plants and the dirt. Wow. Yeah, I think I, think I do. Oh, keep breathing in. Oh. Feel the calming effect. I look at Cole and I nod at him. Yeah. Uh, step a little bit away from them drive plates, views. I step back as well. Yeah, it might get a bit warm for all of us otherwise. I plug my ears. Cole hits a button. Electricity sparks. 
and goes through 52 and the sparkling. <laughs> 52? <laughs> You're yeah. embarking on a journey that no one has gone on before. Okay. You are a pioneer. <laughs> you are the first. <laughs> Reach out <laughs> with your mind. Look <laughs> at the place, the place of comfort, the trees that are almost dead. See there. I can't, I can't. Something, someone. <laughs> Move towards it. I'm trying, I can't, I can't get it. It is your only <laughs> hope of survival. Okay. See it. Okay. Go to it. Okay. It will guide you out. <laughs> I can't get out. Breathe! Don't forget to breathe! Breathe! Deep Stop. breath! Stop. Do you see it? Please. No! Fuse, I'm oh. not getting anything. I had something for a second. He's, he's, he, he's fine! He's strong, aren't you? 52, you're strong! I can't. Tell me you're strong. So bad. Please stop. It fucking hurts. I can't feel anything. Ah. We Please. need to keep going, Silas. We need to keep going. We need to push past this. I can't. Damn. It's a warning up on your screen, Silas. Um, I, we need to. We need to stop. Cease. Cease it. No. We can't stop now. We have Cole, always stopped. It. That is the problem. We have to push past this. Cole, unplug it. Yeah, yeah, no, we should probably un Cole, unplug don't it. Cole, don't touch it. I'm going to unplug it. Dude. Cole unplugs it, and 52 falls limp and unconscious back onto the table. Ah! Ooh. Ooh. Shouldn't have unplugged that one, Fuse actually. Fuse cries out in frustration. Um, the sparkling is dead, uh, lying limp. Violet, what's going on? Violet's covering her mouth. It looks like she's trying not to make a sound and or she might be verge vomiting. What's happening here? Oh, you're, we, oh, okay, I was I gonna say, to. And that's where we're gonna take our break. <laughs> Holy shit. Already? <laughs> Yes. Uh, Woo. Good lord, on. good lord, good lord. All right, we will be back momentarily. Oh my god. Y'all are insane. Okay, everybody go stretch. Get Woo. get some tea. It's been a rough fucking episode so far. We'll be back oh, in just no a moment. No more experiments. Yeah. No more experiments, please. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> weak so weak you need to push past that point no one has the vision or the courage to make it happen well he's alive violet very least yeah weird I wish I could say the same for the sparkling. The what? But now it died for no reason. Yeah. Something on your mind? No, just wondering why I slept being here. Would we like pretend that you took me and then I could like pop out? Get some more for you to sparkle or whatever. <clears throat> Your job, as I understand it, is to keep the vagabonds calm. Keep them from doing harm to themselves or to anyone else. So, okay. If you would please do that, I would thank you. Yeah. 
Sure. And then you guys will just come like, get me some time so I can go. Yeah. Yeah. I believe okay. we have another subject we need you to fetch for us. All right. Yeah, I'm ready when you are, man. For sure. Violet. Yeah. I'm not adept at expressing my emotions, so please don't take my anger and frustration to be pointed at you. It's not. No. You do a very you do a very good job. Thanks. Uh, I do my <laughs> best. I'll leave you to it then. <laughs> Close the door or whatever, or if you have a sound effect. <laughs> I do actually, but that's okay. He closes the door um, and, and leaves. 52 uh, is moaning down on the ground. Uh, Violet, what's going on with you? You're shaking. Uh, yeah. Uh, I think Violet's pretty fucked up. She's kind of taking all of this internally, like, this is her fault. She watched what happened, said, I can't yeah. believe I did this, and scrambled back quickly back into the cell so she could be here when they returned. Yeah. Um, I'm going to crawl over to his body, kind of like animal-like, mm -hmm. like a cat, really, really quietly and just kind of like hover over his face and like look at him to see if his eyes are moving or if any sign of life at all. Oh yeah, he's he's like sweating, he's breathing. Uh, he's He moaned a bit as well. Like if, if, you, if you touch him, he probably flinches from the touch. His skin it, feels Is there anything physically bit. different about him that I Not can that see? Not that you can see. Not that you can see, no. I'm gonna put my hand on his forehead really lightly and try to tell if he's hot or cold. He's super hot. Feverish. I'll pull away really quickly and kind of scramble back and just look at him. Yeah. Oh. 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 Stop! Ah, you're fine! Stop. You're, you're fine! You're fine! Stop! What the? Holy shit. Holy shit. It's... Are you Stop. okay? No. Are you okay? No. Don't let him touch me. Don't. They're, they're gone. They're gone. Are you okay? No, no, I'm not okay. You don't know what they did. Yes, they, I fucking do. You weren't there. What do you mean? I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you out. We're gonna get out. They're still on my side. They're on my side. We're gonna get out. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. So How bad. are you feeling? Can you get up? Can you get up? Yes, yes, I can. Sure, I can try. Show me you can get up. Okay, okay. Hey, I can't carry you again. You you told Who them. Who you are told they? Told them everything. Told you're them such what? An idiot! You're an idiot. I didn't tell them anything. I don't know what you're talking about. You're an idiot. What did I do? I, I. You have no idea what you did, and then they put some fucking thing on you. They put something on you, dude. They put something they, on you. I know they 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 they, they did. Do you still feel it? Is it like on you? No, I just feel like, like shit. I just. Do you have any idea how many people I've brought here? Do you, do you have any idea? Do you have any idea how many people I've brought right here and sat in this box? And they just go away. And I haven't had to sit with them again. I keep having to sit with you. I'm so, Why are you so different. I'm I should be gone. I should be out. I should be having lunch. I was promised lunch. I've been here with you. Do you have any idea how many people have brought? No, I don't. I don't know anything. I don't know how many people you brought in here. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do you whatever. Said you were weak. How are you weak? What happened to the other ones? What happened to everybody else? What happened to the other ones? Do you know how long I've been here? Do you know how long I've been here? No. I thought they were giving you memories. <laughs> I thought they were bringing you back so you could like work. And I asked, 
asked, where do they go? Where do they go after I bring them here? I ask every time, somewhere else, somewhere else, somewhere better. I'm not good enough to go there. Now I'm stuck here with you. What's different about you? I should have just fucking left you in the water. We have to get out. We have to get out. I'm going to scramble over the door and start feeling the edges, like panicked, like, we're going to get out and you're going to be the last. Can you get up? Do you remember anything else? Was there another door or anything? Or did they say anything to you? Are they going to come get you again? I don't know anything. I'm trying. I'm I'm just. We can get out. Okay. I want to get out. I want it. I just want to go home. Yeah, me too, me too, wherever that is. I'm... You don't have a home. You don't even belong here. What if they have reckoned? They might have reckoned. What if it's my fault? What if they kill him and it's my fault? Oh my God, because you're weak. It's your fault. If he dies, it's your fault. If they use you instead. I'm gonna start slamming on the door. Come get him, he's fine. He's not weak anymore! It's gonna be fine. He'll come get us and then we can take him out and we'll run. Can you run? How are you feeling? Can you, can you be fine? Can you be fine? Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be fine. We're gonna get out, it's gonna be fine. Just act normal. It's gonna be fine. That little one likes me. Whatever that one's name is. The one who called you fuck. He'll come back. He should be the one in that room. He doesn't even fucking do- Oh my god, they melted eyes. They actually melted eyes. It wasn't a joke. It wasn't a fucking joke. How are your eyes? I'm gonna go over and grab his head really quick. Your eyes burn? Are they fucking burning? Oh, my body hurts. Fine. I'm just gonna throw them away. They look fine. You look fine. Why are you weak? Uh, I should be out. We should be out. Okay. This is wrong. You did something wrong. I didn't do anything. I swear. I don't know anything. You fucking told them. I didn't tell them anything. What do you remember? About what? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Before the ocean... I I told you, I I remember my my cigarette in my mouth, driving, inhaling, exhaling, and just beautiful roads. That's it. I promise. That's all I know. That's that's everything I know. I promise. That's That's not here. Where did you get that? Get what? Whatever it is you're remembering with the cigarette. The reason they wanted you in that stupid room, the reason they put an animal. I have no idea. I don't know why that animal was there. And I don't know why they filled me up with a bunch of electricity. I don't know anything I don't know. Do you understand that? I have no fucking idea. Okay? So whatever the fuck you're on, I don't know. Not on anything. I had one job. There's been so many of you. Innocent Sorry. people that had no idea what they were doing. I fucking left him here. I just fucking left him. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I... I didn't know. Do you believe me that I didn't know? Yeah, yeah. I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. I, didn't know. I, 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 I don't. I believe you. I, be, I believe you. I believe you. We have to get out. 
Yes. <laughs> We're yes. gonna get out. <laughs> They're gonna come to the door. Come to the door. <laughs> They'll come to the door. <laughs> it's fine. We'll act normal. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the others were like you and they woke up and they just went like, right? They went to the city. I don't, I don't, I don't know the city. I don't know that. I don't know what. I'm sorry. You're not going to go to the city. I'm sorry. You're not gonna know anything. I don't know anything. I'm trying though. I'll, I'll try and learn. I <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know why you're so so upset. <laughs> gotta get out. Okay. Okay. We'll get out and you'll be fine. We'll take you. Reckon will be fine. You don't reckon? You don't reckon? He's a really nice guy. Okay, okay. I pulled him out and I brought him here and they saved him. They gave him voice, but you already had it. So they fucking stuck a thing on your back. What did they do to the hundreds of other people I left in this fucking box? I don't even know. We're gonna get out and I'm gonna start frantically like pulling at the door and reaching all over the crevices okay. and pounding on okay. it. We're gonna get out! Okay, okay. Fine, they'll come. They'll come. They always come back. They always come back. They won't expect me to try to get out. It'll be fine. <laughs> We're gonna get out. What did they say to you? Did you, did you hear anything? Did they say they wanted to do anything else? No, they, Maybe. they just filled me full of electricity in that animal. There was an animal next to me and they filled him with electricity and they were trying to get me to, to be the one, the, the first one, the one who's the pushing on. What? And they were, I don't know, they were arguing about how I was gonna be the one and then all I heard was pull the plug, pull the plug. And then someone said, no, don't pull the plug. And so I, I just, I passed out. I passed out cause I'm weak. I don't know. I I just passed out. I couldn't feel feel nothing anymore, so I just let go. Kind of, I just let it all go, you know. I know. I know. I'm sorry. I'm I sorry. I can't. I don't even know what to do. I don't even know how to get out. We'll, we'll get out of here. We'll, we'll figure out a way. We'll, what uh, he, like you said, they'll come, and then maybe we break through them and and just run. Um, because I I I know I know uh I know I know how to move through this place. <laughs> they, they always, they always come back. They'll come back. Yeah, yeah. But for a they long time, back. no one comes. And Violet and 52 sit here for hours and hours more. We're going to switch scenes. Back in the main area of the lab. Silas, Reckon, Cole, and Fuse are having a discussion. I'm telling you. I'm sorry. We keep getting stopped at the same point. We need to have the courage of our convictions if this is ever going to work. We simply don't have the technology to continue without destroying those we... I disagree. Too volatile, Fuse. It's too volatile. We need something better. We need... He lived! Yeah. He lived through what we did. That. He would have lived if we would have held on just a uh, fraction uh, longer. Uh, actually, there was about an 88% chance that the actual machine would have blown there. So that would have actually been quite bad, I think, probably for all of us. Yeah, we'd uh, all, all have died. Yeah, I, I took the bubble housing off as well, by the way, so... Uh, Thank you. Well, I also unplugged this. And I actually have no idea what this does, which is a bit suspicious, because, uh, well, it's definitely connected to the PLO-free exhaust, which is pretty bad. 
Um, so don't know if we want to. Could you plug run it. it back in, cool? I can. I can plug something back in. We will. If we push uh, too far, they will die like every other subject use. And that gets us nothing. At least now he's alive. You don't more... know that. Just because it hasn't happened yet doesn't mean it will never happen. We have to push this. It's too important. We have time. Why rush it? Why, why are you so desperate? Because we are inches away from the finish line and you want to stop running! We pressed on, then there would be two dead bodies in here. Not just the sparkling. You You're lucky. That. You don't know that. You saw him, he was strong. He could have done it. You know that. In the Dream Deluge project, we did our best way to research the subconscious. If we pushed any harder there, we would have only just not just destroyed him, but destroyed his psyche. He would have been just like everything else walking around, but flesh and bone and not mechanics and servos flinch a little with that. I agree with Silas. Having husks doesn't help us, Fuse. It does. Don't you see that? Oh, Every so. failure teaches us a lesson. But if we don't push it, we don't push it past the point that it needs to go, we will never have success. And I... Do you remember, do you remember, Silas? When we had Reckon. Mm -hmm. And everybody was hemming and hawing and naysaying, it'll never work, it'll never happen. And we proceeded. Now look at him. Reckon's shaking. We know. It can happen. We just have to have the strength to do it. The means do not have to justify the ends. Fine. If you wish to proceed, then you lead it. Uh, I'll just be here. Uh, uh, memory man might be right, actually. You know I hate it when you call me that. Yeah, well, the, uh... Unplugging that exhaust has actually given us a bit more power. What so, does that mean? Uh, well... I've re-piped the, uh... I call it the Carbon-12 Delta Wave Drive Shaft, but I actually have no idea what it's called. And... We might actually be able to push it. You see, see, Dr. Fuse? Or at least the machine should hold. I don't know about the, uh, you know, the fruit that you've plucked. I need some lunch. I think we could all do with some sustenance. Right. Silas, I if mean, you would stay behind, I need to discuss something with you. Yes, I'm not going anywhere. Reckon uh, walks out. Yeah, don't, don't touch anything. I won't. I reckon if I can just do one quick thing, but it's going to take a very uh, particular part, all right? Don't touch nothing. We will. What should I, I do? Feel I need to apologize for my outbursts. It's 
it's expected. This... With passion comes the emotion. It's all right. You can feel it too, can't you? We're so yeah. close, so close to opening a door that everybody has been trying to open since the first cycle. Yes. Imagine it, imagine, imagine speaking to the machine. What it could have to tell us, all of the, the, the stories, the mysteries that would be solved. I do. I imagine this every night, or I rest. I imagine what secrets the Leviathan could speak. I imagine what we would learn. I imagine who and where and how it's powered, what it thinks about, what it thinks of us. I do. I think about it. I fantasize about it, but the readings and the data is telling me that it is just that, a fantasy. Don't you ever go with your gut, Silas? Don't you ever listen to what that inner voice is telling you? Is it all just numbers? No. It's not all numbers. There is much more. There is very few data of the consciousness and in, in, in the psyche of what we think and see. If we could harness it or figure out how to measure it, we could then figure out how to, through mathematics, figure out just the rest of the equation. We don't have it yet. We are both approaching this from various angles. But the data is telling me that we would just have a husk if we were to press. I think, I think we're thinking too small. Oh, so. Did you know that Reckon and his team, you know what they caught recently? Uh, yes, the mermaid, yes. Alive, full, uninjured, unharmed, a mermaid. I, I saw it. It's majestic. I... Their connection is so much stronger and so much more powerful than the beasts we have been trying before. I see. So what you're saying is we could continue the project, but if we were to continue the project, maybe using the psyche of a mermaid would help us reach... I do. Same. I do. And... I don't know if you agree with me, but my theory is <clears throat> we need a mind that is moldable, changeable, still growing. It can't be that of an adult. I don't like where this is going. I don't like having to say it. But you know I'm right. And if this works, it will work. Silas, I need you to trust me on this. It's it will right. work. Right? I trust you. But that comes with trepidation and warning. What should I do?
Well, I answer to you, and you answer to the council. I answer to you in this. I think it's worth the risk. We will. And I'm not a monster. But if this opens the doors, I think it will open. The value is limitless. We could understand why. We could understand where the vagabonds come from, what the lake is. Why they are needed. Why their memories disappear. Where their powers come from. All of that. It's worth it. It's, it's worth it. I think so, too. I think you're onto something. It's dangerous, but I believe we can try it. And we have the capabilities if coal is can fix the quantum exhaust, whatever, I think we could try it. I think... I do wish to see the specimen that you speak of before. Of course, it's in the hold right now. But before we proceed... Yes? I think we need to keep Cole in the dark on this. I don't think he has the strength to do it. Fine. And the last thing. The subject is going to be Violet. I thought you said you weren't going to say it. I want you to know what you're doing before you agree to it. I want you to be in 100%. If you have any reservations, now is the time. She's of the perfect age. Her mind is moldable. More importantly, she's a vagabond. And she's here. She's the perfect subject. Let's do it. I am 100% behind you. Oh my god. What the fuck? Back in the cage. Am I muted? I'm not muted, am I? I was just mouthing it, fam. I wasn't speaking. I just... Are we back? Looks like oh. it. Yeah. Okay. Wonderful. Sorry about that, everybody. A little bit of technical Congrats difficulties. Everyone. Okay. We are switching scenes back inside the metal room. We join 52 and Violet. Uh oh. Sorry. Um, yeah. Um, uh, so wait. I don't think anyone's coming. They did something to you, right? Do you like, do you like strong or something? Can you like pull on the door? No, 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 I don't. I don't think, I mean, I've tried. I tried pushing and you see me pull and I, fuck. I haven't. Fuck, look at me. They called you weak. Are you weak, man? No, no, I'm not weak at all. I'm, I feel, I feel strong. 
Then show me what fuck can do. And try to rip open that stupid door! Okay, okay. You think I have superpowers or something now? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab the door by its, uh, try and get my fingers inside the little slot of whatever, of airspace, and I'm gonna pull it open! Come on, keep doing it, pull! Go ahead and roll for me. Wait, what? Go ahead and roll for me. Oh shit, okay. You can have a plus one. So right, you'll be rolling this. the three plus the one down on the bottom of the sheet. It'll say a plus three, hit that one, and then a plus one, and tell me if you get any fours. I think it does it really ugly when I click this plus three, but yeah, I'll try it does. It. We unfortunately we don't have the. Uh, I'll just do the roll thing here. I got it. I'll copy paste what Brad gave me earlier. <laughs> Fuck is typing. Okay. <laughs> you saw that too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Four two two one. Ooh, so you got a four. Okay. So you have a memory surface here, but it's not yours. Do you want to tell us what it is? Yeah, I, I'm seeing like a lot of Nibiru. If I'm saying that correctly, I'm seeing a lot of halls and a lot of streets and a lot of different, wow, different like places. I'm seeing, I, I'm understanding. I'm jumping up on top of like, uh, on, on top of ledges. And, and moving around, I feel like a cat, some sort of cat or something. I can, I can, I kind of, I kind of move around a little more quickly, and uh, and uh, I kind of know where I am. I kind of understand this place. You do. You see the halls of this place, and you remember coming in here in like a little carrier. Yeah, but yeah, I was in But you can see the halls clearly. So I, I, I saw how they opened this. Yes, you did. Can I use that to open it from the inside? You can make a roll. Four, three, three. So when you try to you can't open it from the inside. Right. But you can almost talk to one of the other creatures in holding. So you can ask one of the other creatures for help. <laughs> Hold on. Oh my god, they broke him. Did they break you? No, no, no. I trust me, there's it's one of those things next door and <laughs> he's gonna let us out. Are you the What do the door opens? Gosh. There is a little sparkling that has jumped up onto the side and opened the door. Per your instruction. There is no one in the hallway. Everything is empty. Oh my god. Oh my god, we have to get out. I'm gonna grab his arm and start walking. You're gonna is that thing, is that gonna No? No, he he's friendly. Alright. Oh. You I think. Oh my god. I don't know how to get out of here. I do. Follow me. I grab her hand. Alright. You guide her through the halls. Um I'm out. Are you moving as quickly as possible, or are you trying to be stealthy? I think uh, when we hit corners, we, we we move stealthily, but as we go down halls, we're going as fast as we can. Okay, both of you roll okay. for me. You can have a plus one, because 52 knows the way. Do I just click the press one? Uh, Yep, so you'll do the three, which is the your roll. regular roll, and then you'll do a plus one. So you okay. get four chances to roll a four, essentially. Boom. Well. Okay, well, you, you got one. I got a four. <laughs> you got one. 
Okay, and then fuck you rolled the two, three, four, one. <laughs> yes, I did. Okay. Ma'am. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, so yeah, you go through the hallways. Tell us what we see, but you don't run into anyone. You can hear yeah, the I mean, sounds of machines whirring, but you don't see anyone. Yeah, it's it's just these long halls that stretch with many different doors, and uh, uh, I mean, I mean, from what I see in my mind, I I realize that uh, you know a lot of them are closed, and and as long as we walk down these and and make sure we know people around the corners, we can go down these halls as fast as we can. So we're we're going pretty fast. Okay. And you do know, you do know at the end of the hall, like towards the exit, there will be a security bot. Okay. I don't know. Okay. How you're okay. Okay. Out of that. All right. So, so 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 from what I remember, that down here there's a there's a, 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 a security robot of some sort, and uh, I don't know how to get around that. Okay. Do Do you know how to do that? I mean, I usually just walk past it. Okay. Um, maybe something happened, and that's why they didn't come get us. Maybe you can distract them or, or something, because if you are, are are cool with them, maybe they won't notice. You can make them turn the other way. I'll I'll go through, and then and then you come right, right back and follow right, right after yeah, me. Yeah, maybe if you just, like, walk behind me so it doesn't, like, see you. Yeah, or... Can you be, or, like, smaller? Can I be smaller? What do you mean? Like, my size. Uh, uh no, I don't think... So. <laughs> okay. No, no, I don't think so. Um, but I just get, get his attention, make him look the other way. I'll, I'll sneak through, and then you come follow right I back after. I get his me. attention. You just go. Yeah, and I'll be, you'll be right. Yeah, exactly. And I'll, I'll wait for They're you. They're not after out. me. Exactly. Okay. 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 Stay here. All right. Shh, shh. And I'm a creep around the corner and try to look Come. like as awkwardly casual as possible. And walk kind of towards the robot. Does it notice me or do anything? It doesn't look like it does anything, no. Okay. I'm going to walk move, yeah. in the way that's not the door, like mm-hmm. kitty corner, and try to like. <laughs> Be a great time to run now! Okay! I, I, I'm going to, uh, I'm, I'm going to run. I'm going to run right past, go through the door. I'm going through. I'm oh, breaking out. All right. Go ahead and roll, both of you, please. Is it just three? Yeah, just three. Uh, you have a plus 152. Unfortunately, Violet, you have a minus one. Oh, shit. I f- Oh, my God. You, was that a critical fail? No. I no. passed. Okay. All right, you passed. So the bot comes to life as 52 is running towards the door. Um, And it looks like we see it kind of lumbering towards 52, but at the last second it turns, notices Violet, and goes for Violet instead. No, 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 wrong guy, wrong guy, you go wrong guy. Stop! Must detain, must detain. No, no, I'm gonna try to bolt around it to go around the door. Unfortunately, you do not succeed in the bot. Picks you up. What the? Is this a joke? Is this a joke? Are you bringing me to Reckon? Reckon! Is this, this is a joke. This is, fuck, just keep going. It's fine. It's a joke. Can you not squeeze? My God. 52 looks back one last time before running out the door and leaving Violet behind. Okay. The security bot takes you, starts walking with you, Violet. This make, is, you can you, make I can roll. walk. You, you can, can just tell me to walk. So it's just, I hate this. Hello? Nothing, no words, okay? You say nothing until today and then they get you to work. I hate this. Reckon! Fuck. Hello, where are we going? I'm gonna knock on its head. Hello! There is no response from the bot. It just continues walking down the hall, although it does not take you where you're expecting, back to the box. It takes you back to the main room. This is, this is the wrong way. Hello! Hello! Okay, wrong way, funny joke! 
It sets, Reckon! It sets Violet down on the experiment table. Thanks. Cool. And Silas nice talk. and Fuse enter. <clears throat> hey. Thanks for the box vacation. That was some hours. <sighs> Violet, just who we were looking for. Right, Fuse? Looking for? I mean, Reckon and I were supposed to get lunch hours ago. Yes, Reckon has left. Great. You kidding me? I don't know how to get home. God. Can you guys give me, like, a ride? Hello? Fuse? You guys are being weird. Okay. And I'm tired and bored and hungry. So. Food is on its way. You shouldn't have to worry for much longer. Okay. Violet? Yeah? You know what we do here, right? Sure, it's like a... It's like a rehab for, uh... The people we find on the beach. You know that's not all of it. I mean, you might like fix them up. Like dude in the cell had some weird eyes, which I don't know, could have been something, right? Has Reckon, has Reckon told you what we helped him with? Reckon? Yes. Uh, I mean, you made him uh, awake. I don't think I need to be told that. I mean, it was pretty obvious, dragon, limp, and get like talky talky back. Seemed kind of rude to ask. So he hasn't told you what we did for him? I mean, not specifically. Well, without going into much detail, we gave him a gift. A gift. A very powerful gift. Yeah? We're attempting to do that with number 52. Yeah, he's a pretty chill guy. Yes. You guys are being really weird. Can we go? Like, why are we even in this room? Violet, I'm going to ask you a question. All right. And I want you to be honest with me. Sure thing. What do you want out of life? Excuse me? What do you want out of life? What motivates you, gets you up in the morning? Uh, food? What, what makes you happy? This is so weird. Um, should we be talking like this? Please answer. I don't know what makes me happy. Uh, a warm bed? Sleeping? Think deeper than that. I think as this is happening, Silas is making his way. Uh, I think um, climbing the wall with his hands as he's trying to find the right, the, the apparatus to extend from the wall. Um, and then on the end of this apparatus, his arm, his crude arm is a long needle. Starts to adjust and fiddle that towards uh, around where the head would sit in the gurney. I guess I like buying stuff. 
What do you want to do with your life? What gives know. you what gives you importance? Do you have goals? Anything you look forward to? No. Getting out of have... here? That's a big one right now. Do you want to have relationships, a family? That's gross. No. I'm fine. You want to have a job? I have a, a job. career. Do you, are you? What have I been th- doing for you for years? Just lay your head back here, Violet. I I don't think I will. Thanks though. So, anyways, uh, I have a job. Kind of liked it until today. Uh, yeah, feeling really weird. What happened today? Why was today different? You left me with him. That's your job. I have never been left that long in a box. Ever. Why did it make you uncomfortable? You threw him back in there. Yes. His eyes were all moon. He was all moon sad. I'm not a consoling person. That's not my job. He was physically fine. Maybe a little pain, a little disorientation, but he was fine. I didn't like it. I would like to go home. Please. And thank you. And you will, just as soon as we finish what we were doing. Oi, oi! Oh, great. That's what I got from Penner himself. Mm. Had to really sweet talk him. Oh, what the fuck, Fuse? Get her out of the fucking chair, didn't I tell someone? Thank you! Don't touch thank nothing. You. What did thank I say? Thank you. Thank you. And I'm going to try to stand oh, yeah. up off the gurney. Uh, this is. won't be necessary, Cole. We are... Uh, we are still experimenting. Uh, we have a couple of questions that we would like to ask. What? Experimenting on her? Interrupting. Well... No, they're not. Look at that. They're asking me about happiness. Do they do this look, to uh, you? Is this like a thing? No, that is. If I may, I'm going to ask Cole the same question, Violet. Mm. Cole, what gives your life meaning? What wakes you up in the morning? Well, this morning, it was you, banging about. Uh, and now, it's this. Penna called it a biolic shifter core. And I have no idea what that means. I do know where it goes. And it should provide us with uh, a little power boost on top of the new power boost. So you should really be able to redline this. But, give me a second. And... Don't touch the chair. What are you doing? Get her out of the chair. Um, I'm saying I tried. <laughs> they seat belted me. Lifting up. The robot, um, the robot right. security bot just lifts her up. So she is not sitting on the chair, but it's still holding onto her. She cannot move. Whoa, 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 okay. What are we doing? What are we what? doing? What? Hello? Watch it. Get the the other one. Jams. Oh. Help me, please. Down. Cole, are you willing to do what it takes to accomplish the goal we have set out here? The fuck are you talking about? You saw what happened with number fifty-two and the sparkling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why yeah, did you? I we can probably do it. All right. Why did you that. pull the plug? Well, oh, because I thought the old thing was going to blow. You know, if that machine blew and they did a, you know, they looked into it a little bit, they'd see that it was overheating, and then you know, it's probably your fault, but I'd get in trouble. But not now. All good. Took the housing off. Yeah, that. But I want to address. I asked you to do something and you did not do it. I need to well, know that that's not going to happen. Well, you say you asked me to do something, I didn't do it, but I mean, maybe it was the right choice. That's not for you to decide. Well, it was either that or everyone's face burns off. Um. I. I... I do not want my face burned off. Is no, this a well, joke? It won't happen. 
It won't happen. Yeah. Uh, just, okay. uh, just breathe a bit. Actually, Red. by pulling that plug, Violet, right, what I did was found out that it was, uh, I don't know how or why, but it was connected to the PLO3 exhaust. Right? So actually, it was, it was actually bringing fumes up not actually getting rid of them. But by disconnecting it, we're actually getting more power. So... It's fantastic. It wasn't actually even running at its Safer full capacity. Well. So now, even with the analysis saying there's an 88% chance that the actual machine might blow up, took the housing off, that'll cool it down, took the exhaust off, and then this. Little, uh, doohickey. So, Violet. um, yeah, what do you want me to do then? Use install this or not? Yes, if you would, please. You please. want me to go and get, uh, jams? Whatever you need. Well, the fuck won't be necessary. All right, well. Please don't leave me. You don't have to leave. You could stay. Oh, I'm not going nowhere. What are you doing in the chair? Get her out of the chair. Yeah. Yeah. She's not in the chair. The robot is holding her. All right, well. Because that's better? We need you to install the device and then we need you to leave the room, cool. Why? Yeah, I agree. Because you don't follow orders, Cole. Well, no, it's not don't. that I don't follow them, it's just that sometimes I forget them. It's different, you know what I mean? Make sure you don't forget this time. All right. Well, I'm... I want to see it go, you know. You know how hard it was to get these off a penner? We've got six. You can... You'll have plenty of time with your machine once we're finished. Right, well, I've only got six of them. I want to see all six of them go. He wants, it's one, one per, look. Look. One I really, I really charge. I realize I see it. The more it's out, the more it's not inserted and installed, so please. All right, well. Going in. Now. I inject the needle Ooh. into the back of the skull. Oh! I'm sorry. What? The fuck? Whoa, whoa. Oh. Huh? Seems to be running. Oh! Nominally. What the? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, let me at least uh, set it oh up. Oh my god! Oh, you could have oh just told god. me you were gonna do this to Violet. You know, you know how fucking rare it is? We pull a nine out. What a waste. He went into my skull. Oh my god, I can feel a hole in my skull. Is this a fucking oh, joke? We'll be fine, just relax. Breathe. <laughs> Breathe. Let Breathe. me put a hole in your skull! <laughs> Don't forget to Breathe. Pilot, it has to be you. Why can't I feel my legs? We needed someone of your so age, on. your maturity. What is going on? We needed a brain that wasn't done growing yet. Are you kidding me? Reckon! Reckon! Oh my god! It's a bit. It's destabilizing a bit, but it's not overheating. Reckon! Reckon wouldn't let you do this. Where is he? Uh, you can, you can push it more. You don't you want can to push do it this. a lot more. Don't I do believe this. Don't do it. It's Reckon fine. is it's bringing the please no bringing the specimen. Thing. Yes, he's bringing the specimen. Yes. <laughs> what the fuck? No. I have no idea what Reckon's doing. <laughs> Well. Reckon never comes. If you're waiting for Reckon <laughs> to bring a specimen, he never comes. What do you want? They have a mermaid. No! Oh. No! 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 I caught one alive no. and whole. No! No! Yeah, no, no! I'm not messing no. with him again. No! You don't want to do this. Don't! 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 In between mine. <laughs> Don't touch me. Don't fucking touch me. <laughs> I 
I'm sorry it had to be you. This is a joke. <laughs> You're joking. This is a joke. <laughs> the gift we're going to give you <laughs> will open so many avenues for our understanding of where we are, where we came from. You were a vagabond like me. You I know. am. Am. I am. Just let me up. This is not funny. <laughs> All the questions. You remember waking up in a haze, not knowing anything, not knowing when, why, how. What are you, talking you are going to help us find that. What? You are insane. This is insane. It's all gonna be okay. Reckon's gonna come through the door and he's gonna tell you that you're insane. Well, it doesn't look like Reckon's coming, so. I'm going to fetch specimen. <laughs> Try and keep her calm. <laughs> what? That will happen. What? In three, two. What? One. Violet <laughs> struggles a bit as she feels memories leaving her mind. <laughs> One at a time. <laughs> as they begin extracting everything you've ever known. That was easy. Look at the machine. Readings are, uh... stable. For the first time. For you it was. Uh... We're on a time limit, though. Basically got pa battery power this time. Time. Right. No, no limit on the power. Uh, but limit on the time. We will. No. <sighs> Still say it's a waste. We will see. We will see. Fuse happens to have an idea, a pioneering one, something I necessarily not. Right, but she's banging. You know what I mean? Like no. Well, we're pulling bare people out of the lake, but most of them are butters. You know. Yes. But we need a still maturing mind. We theorize that the, the mentality of one that is still growing can absorb the, the information of both themselves and also the fusion of another consciousness. We assume... That it'll work. Right, well, it's working, but if you scramble our brains... I have to wait a while for a... Yes. That is why I'm not taking lead on this one. Fuse will be signing for this. Yeah, well, old memory man didn't even get to see the memories go out. Why do you call him that? This thing's almost rinsed. Oh. So it is. Um, we don't have much time. Can't put another one in while it's running. Yes, yes. Yeah, this way. In here. Come in and people wheeling, are wheeling, wheeling in. Wheeling in a very, very large uh, container filled with fluid and a mermaid, which is a creature that looks like this. Beautiful, isn't she? No. Get it away from me. It's quite. Just keep keep it on that side. 
place. I don't know if they even function out of the tank. They out should of the water. function out of the tank. Oh, I don't like them. Right, in theory. Okay. And you see... Uh, You've probably never seen one before, actually, now that I... You see Fuse, like, putting his hand on the glass, like, very, like, lovingly stroking the glass. Mm. I've waited to meet you. Have you been waiting to meet me? Fuse, we ain't got long. Okay, this thing actually runs on, uh, uh, I don't know what. A time limit, though. All right? Is how are our readings? Is their memory? Um, they're gone. He's empty. Yeah, easy peasy too. Stable readings. Stable yes. readings. Very all well. the power you need. And uh, I suggest you push it. Did you have a? I assume they're stored in the normal place. Very well. We might need it. <clears throat> Back up. And I walk over to the, um, I don't know, sleeping is the right word, but body of, of a uh, violet. And I take her bracelet off. It's a small, simple gold bracelet. This will do. I take it over to where, like, the the memory battery, like, and I put it in there. Flip a Use. switch. Use if this is to work. I do have something. A bit of a side bit of a side endeavor um, from the dream deluge project do you mind if I no Eat. please we will I hold her head walks over to her I grab um, I hold her head steady she opens uh, her then? eyes and looks at you, Stylus. Or Silas. It's all right. I called you Violet because it was your favorite color. We knew that it would give you the most calming readings. Put some lenses from the Dream Deluge project. It'll help track our psyche and our consciousness. We are successful. Look away now if you need to. And he takes a small blade out. Um, and he scrapes. And then his hands move. And there's now this like geometric purple iris. We just see. He goes over to a tablet. They are fused online. I've never seen the process up close. You're fascinating, very skilled. Hey, you got about six minutes. It's between us. We're not supposed to use this technology anymore. Or four minutes. Oh, okay. We, we Thank you, Paul. Maybe three minutes. Very well. I've been preparing for this day. And I, uh, there's like a little, like, wheelie, um, stairway that I can, I wheel it over to the tank. I've been preparing for this. I knew this day would come. And I, uh, grab a control that's like hanging down and this, like, harpoon, like, Look like it looks like a harpoon gun, like kind of like gets into position above the tank. Silas, if you will, please connect her. Yes. 
Here we are connected. Should be online call. Uh, well, it's reading as offline, but it is online, so not sure what that means. Be a replicator. I say go for it. <coughs> Pretty well. And you see, like, uh, Fuse just kind of pause. Like, with his finger, like, right over the button to, like, shoot the harpoon. Violet, Violet's purple eyes dart over to you, Fuse. This is a gift. This is going to be so many breakthroughs going to be in your name. You'll help countless thousands and thousands more to come. You might actually understand why we're here. Sorry. And the, the harpoon shoots out. It's got like attachments to it, wires coming out of it and all that. It just goes <laughs> straight through the spine of the, the mermaid in the tank. Cole, now. All right, here goes nothing. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. That is a... Uh... What? What? That is anomalous. Well, it's reading as a power surge, but it's uh, fine. I think it's just... Uh, I think you can push it more, Fuse. I, like, take the dial and keep, like, turning it up. <gasps> turning it up. Let me decrease the power to that. Push it more. Pull! Pull! How are we looking? Oh, more, 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 more. Go on, go on. Go. go on. More power. I keep adjusting more. <laughs> oh. This will work. This will work. This has to work. Uh, the science is there. Uh, it's on you now. Violet, <laughs> you stand on the precipice. You are on the edge of a cliff. <laughs> we need you to jump! Seth. But know that you will be, you will be fine, you will live! It's at that moment, Silas, your monitor begins going off. Violet's vitals are failing. What's happening? Her vitals are failing. <laughs> we, we can't keep going. We I can't stop, we can't stop now! I yeah, can yeah, see them. Good. I can Stop see them. Before. I can see them. I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna You're see them. Right. It's just a surge, Silas. Silas, yes. Just a surge. I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna see them. I'm gonna see them. I can see them. I can see them. I'm gonna see them. I gotta get them. They're gone. You feel it, don't you, Violet? Violet falls back, eyes wide open, and she flatlines. Oh, it may, maybe it. Yeah, maybe it won't assert actually. No, 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 she's fine. She's fine. And I turn it up. The electricity no, 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 goes, no, 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 no. But nothing happens. No, she's perfect. The she's perfect. This is going to work. Yeah, I can try, yeah. Uh... Fluctuating power away from, uh, no, I don't think we've got the time. The bust, mate. I j like jump down the stairs and I run over to Violet and I just like pound on her chest a couple times. God, come on, this is going to work. 
You're only hurting her. She was strong enough! <laughs> you might flip over a table full of shit. Table. Oh, I will you help me move floor. this specimen? Uh, uh, wait, which one? Both. Um, uh, I don't want to touch the mermaid. Fine, I will wheel the mermaid. Yeah, all right, I'll get to it in a minute. I want to take a look at this. To help us move her. Okay. The Uh. security bot picks up Violet. Destination. Rep. The bot carries Violet's body down the hall, all the way down to the left side, where there is a garbage chute. It opens the chute and tosses Violet inside. Yeah, Fuse, don't worry, yeah, we've got five more fish in the sea, yeah? I can probably get more out of Penner if this, uh... Gives us some results on one of them. You know how long we've waited for <laughs> the conditions to be just right. How long will it be before we can get another live mermaid? Another subject with her compatibilities? Yeah, I, I ain't really been here that long, but uh, I'm going to look after these, and uh, good luck fishing, yeah? I walk over to where the bracelet, the, me- the memory cache is. I open the door. I grab the bracelet out. And I put it in my pocket and I leave. Outside of the lab, in the alleyway, in the golden tunnel, Violet's eyes open. She gasps for breath. <laughs> Just need to dump this stupid spark tail. I'll bring Violet to lunch. <laughs> Sparkling. Shit. Ah. Ah. Heave a bag into the dumpster. <laughs> you hear a sound when you do that, Reckon. What? Oh shit, was it alive? I'd love it if it was alive. I'd raise that one. Hello? Uh, Violet? Hello? What, what are you doing in there? I don't know. Can you help me out? Yeah. Uh, yeah. You reach in and Take her arm as best I can. When I grab his arm, I'm going to put it up to my face. Violet? <laughs> What's wrong? Why are you here? I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know. put my hand on her face. And... Corners of her eyes are bleeding. Uh, looks like 
very similar to the eyes you've seen before, Reckon, on many, many experiments before this one. Her mouth is full of blood. Who am I, Violet? Do you remember me? You're Reckon. Right? Yes. I know you. I think. I don't think we should be here anymore, Violet. I don't think so. I don't know where I'm supposed to be, though. Supposed to be with me. I do this to you. Did what? For Why do you look that way? I'm gonna reach out and touch his face and touch a tear. I feel I dry. To... I'm thirsty. Oh, I'm really thirsty. Get you some water. It's all right. Yeah. 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 With you? Yeah. Okay. We're not staying here anymore. Uh, fuck. I don't know where we are. Uh, oh, we're in the... I'll explain later. Uh, we have to... Me. Reckon pulls out a pair of pliers from his tool belt and jabs it into his arm and pulls out a DATCOM and tosses it on the ground and steps on it. Why would you do that? Because <laughs> the fault of us. They probably removed yours when they threw you out, but I need to check. <laughs> threw me out? Yeah. Just the trash. <laughs> it should not. <laughs> You're so much better than them. Okay. It'll be okay. You don't have to run anymore. I'll run for you. Where would we run? But they can't find us. Back to my lake. At that moment, I'm going to get really wide eyes and jump really close to him. Yes, please. We should do that now. Yeah. Did you walk? She looks down at herself, unsure of her limbs. She tries to walk. stand. She wobbles. Yes. Yes. Come. Oh, put your arm around my shoulder. Let's run. We need to run. We need to leave. We need to leave fast. And we need to leave now. O okay. I'll keep you safe, Violet. It's You'll the last thing I do. Yes. They're gone now. They're gone now. What? What are gone? Where are we going? We're going home. That's where we're going to end the session today. Y'all fucking killed it! Oh my Ooh. god! Oh, whoa! Holy shit! Oh man! 
Wow! Wow. Wow. Y'all are insane. Knocked Whoa. it out of the park. What? <laughs> <laughs> that was fun, dude. That was insane. That was so good. Dan, not crying at you was probably the heart. Like, I just ignored you. I've never ignored you more in a Zoom call. <laughs> Heartbreaking shit I've ever seen. Oh my God. So I'm... good. Ugh. Wow. <sighs> How's everybody feeling? Okay. <laughs> Pretty emotionally a exhausted. Lot. Yeah, it was yeah. Well, and lot, forever. Yeah. yeah. So sleep, sleep good tonight. Yeah, that was a <laughs> super amazing challenge, and everybody kicked mega ass at it. Um, so we knew uh, that Speth wouldn't be with us this week, so we wanted mm. to um, take this opportunity to kind of do the backstory of uh, one of the characters, Violet. Um, and everybody here rose to the challenge, and then some, I'd say. Um, it was incredible episodes. So let's go ahead and do some shout outs. John, you want to start us off? Yeah, Number of 52. Course. 52. 52, aka fuck. Okay. <laughs> I'm good. I was so fu- I, I like had oh, more. <laughs> started cracking up. When the, it was so, such a serious time, but like, uh, it was great. It was super fun. That was super, uh, uh, a big challenge. I know PB had told me like yesterday, she was just, or two days ago. Yeah, she was I like, waited. Yeah. We're doing a one shot and i was like wait what <laughs> and kind of like how the whole show started back in the beginning it was like you know Dive just in. all you need to know is you're just something else you're another person and i was Wake like oh again, this john is gonna be crazy. <laughs> yeah. just crazy you uh, killed so it, that was john. a great challenge it. and super fun and uh i love i mean me and ck have never gotten to like role play like that like that was, to get that to was go. next level so like that, that was insanity really magical i mean really like that was my first time ever i it, you know as as dex i don't like her character at all like he just yeah. she, she reminds me of like a horror movie character so i'm just like no i'm good uh she but, is they made her you into know, a monster right. she was like, yeah so <sighs> that was just so fun thank you guys so much uh, i have a twitch youtube all that fun stuff i always have to jet out of here because i gotta take care of the kids and stuff but man i I hope we do another one shot to find out more backstory of something else. Yeah, like, I'll definitely so... do more of those. Don't worry. I feel like now, I mean, not uh, as John, I love Violet. Like I get it. <laughs> I get why I get she it. is. She's a blank. She was a blank slate that like is six is young and just doesn't, you know, she's not creep. She's just, a, I personally, this is how I feel. <laughs> I'm just like, before I was like, what is this vibe? But now I'm like, I get it. <laughs> She was a race clean and now she's been with Reckon and it's like all she knows is what Reckon has told her and like what they've experienced from then on out. So very cool. Thank you guys so much. That was awesome. Mm. I'm going to jet you. on. Too yeah. much work today, John. Your kid. Incredible, yeah, John. incredible yeah. job wow. today, John. So fun. So Hell fun. Yeah. Good old fuck. And with the mermaid. mermaid. Forget you. The I know. <laughs> the mermaid. Oh. And good news. If I ever die. Uh, as dead, you can play this fuck. I might, I might, I might, I might play fun. 52. Fuck's coming back, maybe. Fuck's you know, you never back. know if he's still around in the world. But. Fuck's right. coming back. You want to roll for me, actually? <laughs> Wait, you want me to roll? Yeah, just go oh. ahead and roll for me. Give her a fuck roll. That fuck roll. Give me the <laughs> final, the final <laughs> fuck roll. The final fuck roll, just three diet, three. Yep. I just want to see that fuck is typing. Four one one. <laughs> yeah, you roll the four. He's alive. You're alive. Nice. <gasps> 52 Buckley. is alive that somewhere. Was still alive yeah. Or dead. yeah, yeah. Of if you, if you, I thought when I got out that door, I was alive. I mean, it's 20 <laughs> years ago, so yeah, you, you, you know, a lot could have Holy happened, sh- but yeah, you're alive. Holy F- shit! Fuck I love lives. this show. I love you guys. I love right. you, PBL. Get out of here. Fuck lives. <laughs> We're gonna see him. John. He's gonna. Yeah. He's he's gonna <laughs> appear at some point in the main game. This old man's gonna appear at the front of a cave and go, "Everybody, my name is." Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Ah! Who are you? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. You can. I go by many names. But my first was fuck. fuck. <laughs> Wait. Where did John go? Uh, he uh, fucked off. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, I see what you did there. Cord, you're up. Hi, uh, I'm Cord or Mythomatic. I stream on Twitch. You can follow me on Twitter. I am, my brain is mush, my emotions are mush. That was way more challenging than I thought. And I thank you all for evoking some amazing emotions, emotions today. Um, that was nuts. Yeah, thank you. Thank you for having me a part of it. I hope I did uh, well, uh, CK. I know it was your backstory and I hope we, we, we did all right uh, and with the, the 
the tender touch of us storytelling and within your oh, backstory is always is always a, a nerve-wracking one. So, but I hope we honored it well, and thank you all for being here and experiencing with me because that was nuts. That was a lot of fun. It was um, it was something. <laughs> Dude, crushed it, man. I yeah. love that character. Everyone love was it. so fucking good. Like yeah. I, I kind of want to know Perfect. what they're up to now. Like I yeah. just right. Ooh. They'd be super yeah. old, right? Who who was kind of old there? Because I was a kid, I think. Yeah, some you were. You were about I was sixteen, a seventeen. Adult. Yeah, Chad <laughs> was, was like, oh, yeah. Yeah. I had to I come in there and be like, probably, no, he was probably sixteen. Silas was in his like middle age yeah. thing, I'd assume. Yeah. I don't know. Is How old was guess, Silas? Can I ask? Probably in his fifties, I think. Ooh, Silas seemed so old. To Silas me, is kinda. old. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like he would probably still be alive, right? Because we're also in a very, like not bougie but we're in a, a pretty like decent area it's not the it's not the umbra yeah the yeah. lifespan I mean, is so much like, longer here yes yeah yeah uh, uh, so they'd yeah. still be there mm -hmm. the yeah, umbra's possibly. lifespan is about it might just be 34 yeah. or 36 years old if you're born in the umbra you'll be dead by your 34. yikes Sounds okay great. so moving on <laughs> brad you're up <laughs> That's Hello, a downer. it's me. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, I just, I'm pur purging all the jokes that are coming into my brain. Look at this one thing I didn't use. I had this. And I was oh, like, I might no! be able to use it for something. <laughs> and when you were like, oh when you were God. like, you were like, cut the thing. I was like, maybe I could, but it was just too quick. I was like, by the time I go and get that thing. And... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Curtain shears, uh, that's so good. <laughs> I just got a bunch of random things and was like, I'm going to be that character that just pulled like everyone's yeah. like oh he's character gonna be like a hacker or whatever and i'm yeah, gonna bring no. out a hammer or whatever it was so good also can i just um, say like how crazy it was that i think everyone myself included was expecting cole to not stick to his guns when presented with the opportunity but instead he stayed to see the machine run and that is so horrifying to me like that yeah, is a, that's a bad guy. Like holy <laughs> shit! Like evil little bastard. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, so just, scary. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I love yeah. that. I love yeah. that. I, yeah. I fully expected him to turn coat on and the whole didn't. thing, and he was like, "No, oh, man, I just got these fucking things. Yeah. I want to see them work. <laughs> yeah. I want to see what the fuck they're doing." <laughs> like, um, oh really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah I thought that'd be a fun has always too. been a consistent role player for sure. I, um, I'm just, because everyone, when we were planning this, everyone was like, oh, well, PB was like, you're all scientists, pretty much, apart from obviously, like, Reckon and Violet can have some nuance to it, and John w might not be, whatever, and I was like, I kind of already play a scientist. Yeah, you do. In a way, so I kind of didn't want to be like a, oh, well, we should press the buttons, and, or whatever. <laughs> did, did you have a jargon a generator for what you said yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I thought you did i so love good. it like so much it's so good. stuff out of my brain but yeah i had I put on like a, a, a techno babble generator i've used that exact thing before <laughs> in like space stuff yeah it's like, so good i thought that's what you were doing it was perfect and i'll, and I'll just fucking pull things but i also kind of like the idea that he's just kind of learned through muscle memory so even yeah, no, I, I definitely caught that i don't know what this does but i know if i pull it in, plug it in here right, it works they're not yeah. that's probably not what it's actually called it's just what he calls it and it still mm -hmm. sounds like techno babble was kind of a thing that i wanted to do anyway it was super fun i'm glad i got to play a little bit more of a chaotic like hearted ish character until the reveal that he was pure evil yeah um until the reveal and, that he uh, was an asshole yeah it's super fun who knows maybe it could have gone all differently and there would have been a romantic love story no that wouldn't have been he was awful um <laughs> that's uh that's me though i'm also awful in real life you can watch my Twitch <laughs> channel where i <laughs> where I'm almost as evil as all of these characters were this evening. Um, uh, I don't know what's going on. I'm just about to finish playing through all the Uncharted games, which have been awesome. Uh, and so I'll be picking a new game probably tomorrow, but to play for the next day. If you want to watch my stream, that's it. Cooking. Are you picking you say, a game or is your just chat voting? I do a thing where I, I put a list up and everyone votes. It's we wild. Do a round. Awesome. It's yeah, so intense. It. I have stopped <laughs> myself oh, yeah. from going live so that I can see the end of this stupid poll. <laughs> yeah. It's so stupid. It's the stupidest part but of my stream. But it's entertaining. It's is very everyone entertaining. Voting on the next game to play, but that's how we do it. Democracy okay. on my channel. Yeah, that's it. Thank you. Awesome job, everyone. Dan, you're up. Hi there. I'm Domestic Dan, and I played a younger Reckon today. Much mm -hmm. younger. 
20 light years younger. Mm-hmm. Uh, but uh, 80 cycles, yeah. right? Yep. 80 cycles, correct. Um, 240 months. Uh, anyway, <laughs> but uh, yeah, today was Nerd. great. Nerd. <laughs> Nerd. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> so wait, true story. I was working on the video before the stream today and I messaged Dan while he was in bed and I was like, Dan, wake up. I need to do some math. How many, how many lake years and uh, cycles has it been if we're doing 20 years ago? <laughs> And he told yep. me, thank you. Thank you, Dan, for yeah, waking no up problem. to do the math happy, for me. <laughs> happy to help waking up the, and doing math is the first conscious thought that I have. <laughs> math. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, you can follow me uh, at Domestic Dan everywhere. Uh, I do lifestyle and variety casting. Um, and uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to chill out with some Minecraft tonight because I need like just an emotional purge from the last six months. Okay. Yeah. And today, from this, <laughs> you know, also that, I will fucking die. This everyone. one isn't real. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh, and I guess next week <laughs> on Monday, I'm doing some show or something. I don't know. It's, mm-hmm. it's, it's something, something there. You mm-hmm. should probably tune into it, I guess, here at 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 Eastern, for like some new show that's happening. Horizon Zero Dawn, for those who don't uh, know, can't. and Dan is GMing it wait. while he aggressively mm-hmm. eats a burrito. Can't wait. <laughs> I'm nervous. This was gonna be the food I was gonna give Violet, but it didn't. We, it didn't yeah, happen. Yeah, so, so now you're fine. eating lunch. Okay. God. Perfect. Thanks. Okay. Thanks. Violet, classy Katie, who killed it today. Hey there, everybody. I'm classy Katie. I had the pleasure of playing pre-Violet, which is what we have coded her <laughs> when talking about her, which was pretty fun. Um, today was pretty dope. Everybody was amazing like I was just like every time I was off camera I was sitting here like like the acting was just astronomical it was Um, so good it was so good like it was just really really good you guys were amazing I have to say it's been like a secret passion of mine to be the person on the table in like a mad scientist story so I've like lived my fantasy like every fucking horror movie that's ever existed there's always the experiment in the mental hospital and I'm gonna be that person to to be that person I'm just like that was and that was a fantasy lived through and i'm pretty excited about it i hope you guys enjoyed it uh i stream and stuff on twitch and whatnot i'm checking it out do you remember when we initially were like let's do your backstory i think all we had talked about was oh let's maybe go and do the you know whatever made her decide to not want to work with the anki anymore yep. and then yep. i think it was like three in the morning i messaged her being like dude what if it's the you know when they make you the thing and then she was like i get to be on a table it's being oh, yeah. experimented on yes yes all the yes i was so excited i was literally like how dark can we go with this she's like katie we can't go too dark i'm like okay but can they cut me up or something because like i'm down for this yeah when it's dark is like logically reasonably possible oh, only because she dope. was 16. like honestly yeah. if it had been any other age i i would have been a little bit more comfortable but it hurt me it hurt me to Think of a sixteen-year-old girl. Was, getting... Yeah, I was. I was struggling. Yeah, 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 that was hard for me. But it's part of her backstory, and yeah, it was good. You all killed it. I thought it was it great. Was dope. You did a wonderful job. I liked it. Sean was dope too. That was fun in this. God, side. you Watching too. Watching him lose his mind was like. That was awesome. Chef's kiss. Oof. Yeah, it was so good. Especially, should we tell them that John knew nothing? Uh, yeah, John knew nothing. I guess he didn't say anything. John knew nothing coming into this. Like, we all had secret Once plans again, in the background. John. Yeah, yeah poor again, John. No, so, yeah. John just got thrown yeah. in a cell with me, basically, <laughs> and told to role play. <laughs> <laughs> and he killed it. He's so he good. killed yeah, it. Yeah, Slayed it. Yeah. yeah. Confident he's going, all right, oh, I have good. no idea what's going on. Let's do yeah. this. Yeah. <laughs> killing it. Fit the character. God, it was so good. <laughs> yeah, it was so good. Yes. Thank you, my darling. Zeke. Oh, wait, I have one other thing to say. Can I just say how much of a pleasure it's been watching the two of you again in a scene? I just live for it. <laughs> I live for it. It was so good. Oh, I, had, I so wanted good. to say one thing about that. Yeah, go for it. I just want to say, like, kudos to my man saying I'm perfect on a role play. <laughs> that is recorded <laughs> forever. I was, was lying there. Was yeah. <laughs> she was perfect. <laughs> I'm lying. perfect. And I just want everyone to know. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. Oh, goodness gracious. She was perfect. 
What? <laughs> what? Uh, <laughs> being the operative word. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, Zeke, you're up. <laughs> uh, hi, everybody. Don't follow me. Just follow her. Just follow Class Katie. Uh, and that's all. I'm just kidding. Uh, no, follow me. I'm uh, at or slash Ezekiel underscore III on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. Uh, I'll be playing uh, the last part of uh, Song of Horror tomorrow at noon Pacific if you want to tune in. I'm sorry, Song um, of what? I'm playing the last part of Song of Horror oh, tomorrow. Oh, totally thought you said ah. Song of Horror. <laughs> I was like, uh, what? What game is this? Different song, same <laughs> tune. Um, but uh, <laughs> that's what's happening at noon Pacific tomorrow. But thank you, most of all, thank you so much for watching. Uh, this is a treat to do every week, uh, especially stuff like this, when you can yeah. really, like, really go for the shit, you know what I'm saying? Uh, everybody did a fucking fantastic job today. You can, you really can tell when people put their vulnerability on the line. Yes. They really, it's really moving experience to see people with raw, like their nerves or the raw nerve showing. And it's, it's really great. It's, it, I hope people look at stuff like this and go, well, those guys, they don't give a fuck. They'll let their emotions out. They'll cry, they'll yell, and they're not afraid. I hope if anything you can get from this, it's okay. It's okay. We're all, like, it's, it's so cathartic and it feels so good, especially when you're in a group of people who feel the same way. Yeah. And I'm, I'm grateful to be a part of groups like this group because of that. Um, Word. And let me tell you, man, playing a fucking bad guy, it's so nice until you realize how bad it is. Like, when you, like, how bad what you're doing. Ooh. I mean, it scrapes your soul a little bit. Yeah. Like, it butts right up against it and, like, drags the nails. It's like, this is inside your head. Yes. Like, you're capable of thinking of these things. How does that make you feel? And you're just like, but I never, no, ah! <laughs> Man, that moment when you came in and you said, you know, I'm proud of you or you're doing a good job when you were nice to Violet. That was nasty. Dirty oh, play. Dirty, dirty play. play. Oh, but well done, well played. Very, very, very well, good. Well, I knew what we were gonna have to do to her later and I wanted her to be more compliant. <laughs> Wow. Uh, just like with 52 yeah, slash still, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's, yeah. It was the same thing you did. It was perfect. Yeah. So good. That's classic victim prisoner. Like, isn't that, what is that called? When the prisoner thinks they're like friends with the bad Stockholm. guys? Stockholm. Stockholm, Stockholm yeah. 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 Classic Stockholm, yeah. Fucking wild. Anyway. I want I'm, you to know you're doing a great job. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> please. Oh, that's the title of the episode. That's the episode title. I want to. I want you to know you're doing a great job. Yeah. I thought it was okay. fuck. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I I won't be able to get fuck. away with that. Actually, I don't think we'll be able to put ads on this this episode because the f bomb, right, Brad? That's how YouTube works. Uh, in the first fine. minute. Yeah, you'll be fine. Oh, if you're safe, right. if you don't swear in the first minute, you're you're fine. <laughs> well, that there you so go. Weird. No ads. Yeah. I won't I think, put it I on. Think that might be a. Yeah. I, I just won't put it on for this rumor, this thing. But still, oh, is it? Be, okay. be in general, it doesn't it doesn't have a problem. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm yeah. I'm PB. I was the narrator for you all today. Thank you so much for being here. I just want to bring focus back to the crew again because they killed it. Um, it was a phenomenal episode. Everybody did an incredible job, and I'm really proud of this cast um, that I can throw a challenge at them, literally answering their questions five minutes before we go live, and everybody just slides into character and brings to life... Uh, someone's backstory in such a way that is we can all feel it and it's like what john said earlier i john love violet now and that's kind of how i feel knowing everybody's backstory as a gm or a narrator i get to see all the pieces of them and sometimes in shows you don't get to see you don't get to see that so i'm really grateful that we do get to have an opportunity to do that because i love all of these characters so very 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 much um so yeah that was it um, you can find me at Twitch and Twitter at Pumpkinberry. Otherwise, um, I'm going to play a trailer for a new show coming up on Monday that Dan is GMing, and then I'm going to take us out. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. We'll see you next next Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> Every time. Wait, where is the wait? Where's the outro button? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Oh my god. Where is the... Uh, hold it, Dan, hold it. Hold it, hold, hold it. it, Dan. Just keep going. Wait, Dan, I haven't found it yet. Let's keep going. <laughs> okay. <laughs>